Today, I'm going to be exploring every single C in Roblox Blocks Fruits to try to find deleted, removed, or secret items, fruits, or abilities in Blocks Fruit. If you didn't know, Blocks Fruits has been around for years, and there is different versions of fruits that have been removed that are still in the game. You just have to know where to find them. So in this video, I'm going to be finding every single one of them. But let's not waste any time. Let's go ahead and find the first one. And you know what? I'm going to get some help from my subscribers in my Discord called the Goobers. So if you want to be in videos like this, join in the discord discord.gg slash goobers but let's find our first deleted slash removed item in blocks fruits. but okay goobers are you ready to go on this adventure hey they said yes let's go all right let's go ahead and hop in our boat and head to the first boss all right but we're taking off to fight our first boss which is going to be located at the prison over there and while i'm sailing over there with the goobers if you are not subscribed yet hit that subscribe button and join the discord if you want to be in videos like this all right but we have just arrived to the prison and our first boss is right inside here and as you can see there is a little spider fruit right here and this boss the swan actually uses the old version of the spider fruit called the string fruit and i actually uh used to use this this fruit before they removed it so i want to see what this string fruit actually looks like all right there's this one he's only a level 240 so he's not going to do a lot of damage to me i'm literally a max level but let's see what his string fruit moves actually look like okay yeah there's one of them right there dude yeah dude th these are like definitely old moves bro are you gonna start swinging at me or what dude i want to see your moves stop trying to punch me with those big fat fists Bruh. all right uh, yo yeah look at that it's one of the old string moves all right. Oh, yeah. There's a move right there. That one is definitely weird. That one's definitely old. We're going to need to compare these to the regular string fruit moves. Oh, there was another one. It's like a tornado. <laughs> Dude, yeah. You wish you could hit me. But yeah, I'm pretty sure those are all the moves. So I'm just going to, you know, get rid of him. But now I'm going to compare those moves to the current string fruit move. Or it's not the string fruit anymore. It's actually called the spider fruit. So let me go ahead and equip that. And I think that my moves might be awakened. So I don't know if this is like a very accurate representation of what this move looks like. Yeah, this is definitely the awakened version of spider that I have. But yeah, I'm pretty sure that the moves that he used down there obviously they look very different than my moves because mine are awakened but i don't think that he used the unawakened for i think that that is the old version and boys this is only one of the many bosses that use a crazy item that's hard to get in this game and the last boss uses old versions of a sword which is really sick as well hold up but all right goobers let's hop back in our boat and head to our next location you know what i'm gonna i'm gonna let them uh drive this time because i crashed the boat into the prison on accident <laughs> All right, but we just arrived to the fountain. And, uh, you know, this one is a little bit different because this one actually has an item that you can't even unlock and that was never unlockable. And I don't know if this is a fruit or it's just an ability, but there's a boss on this fountain island right over here called the Cyborg, and he can fart on you. What are you talking about, man? I'm not joking. <laughs> Check this out. All right, I'm going to smack him in the face. Let's see if he'll fart on me. Look at all the goobers all around me. All right, let's see. Fart on me. I dare you. Oh, yeah. Yeah, he just farted everywhere. Yeah, he's got the fart fruit i would say that this might even be like the meme fruit imagine if there was like a meme fruit in the game i know that there's an admin meme fruit but this might be like one of the meme fruit items because why wouldn't they add like a fart fruit to the meme fruit and he actually can shoot rockets out of his hands too we just have to like you know make him want to shoot a rocket at us by punching him in the face a few times <laughs> yeah right there yeah he shoots out rockets now i'm gonna give one more honorable mention before we jump to the second c and it's actually in middletown where we need to go to travel to the second sea so let's hop back on our boat goobers or actually you know what i, I, th I think i'm gonna take care of the cyborg really quick uh i'm gonna murder him i'm not gonna let this cyborg get away with literally farting all over me dude like that I, I'm, not, I'm not gonna accept that disrespect okay let's go to our boat now <laughs> all right but there we go we arrived to the middle town which is where we're gonna need to get to the second sea and this boss right here the saw he's only level 100 he's one of the lowest level bosses in the game but this guy actually uses an old version of a sword. And if you guys want me to make a whole video on bosses that use old swords, like deleted swords, old swords, stuff like that, leave a like on this video. If this video can get a thousand likes, I will make a whole video on deleted swords next. As you can see, nope. this is what the nope. old uh, sword looks like. Dude, nope. He's trying to swing at me. He's just, how are you missing? <laughs> yeah, look at that. So that's the old move. That's one of the old moves. And that's what the new moves looks like. Like that's that, it, it looks way cooler now. Like this one like slams the sword down and that's what the combo moves looks like and then that's what the second move looks like they look completely different now as you can see but they're the same sword but you know i'm not gonna waste any more time here i'm gonna murder the saw now <laughs> and okay we're gonna make our way over here so we can talk to our little captain buddy and go to the second scene all right but there we go we finally arrived to the second
can see. And by the way, while we're on our way to uh, find this boss, if you guys want to check out some of my UGC items, like this right here, I got some uh, Goober I merch. Join my Roblox group. The link will be down below. We're at 63,000 members, and let's see if we can get to 100,000. All right, but let me go ahead and spawn in our boat. There we go. And Goobers, go ahead and get on the boat. We have to go to our next boss, which is going to be located on that far island over there, the Ice Island. Bro, what the heck is happening to the bridge? Bro, wait, what the? What is going on? Why is the bridge gone? What is happening? Why The bridge is literally disappearing. All right, you know what? I'm not going to question it. Oh! Oh, the boat! The boat! What is it? Our boat's upside. What? What? What just, what just happened? Our, our boat's gone. Oh! Oh! All right, I don't know what just happened. Our boat just magically appeared, but let's go find this ice admiral. All right, we arrived. We arrived to the castle. This ice admiral uses the old version of ice. Yeah, look at that. Look at that, dude. That's like the older version. So let's see what some of these moves look like. Okay, ow. Okay, so that's one of the attacks. I think he has a ranged attack that he will use on us if we can like get some distance away from him. So if I go up here... Okay, yeah, there's one of the moves right there. Okay, yeah. This is the old version of the ice fruit. And I'll show you guys what the new version looks like in a second. All right, ow. That's another one of the moves right there. Okay, yeah, that move right there. That's the one. That is the removed one. That one is the old Are version sure of ice. All right, actually, I think I was wrong. The deleted move that this uh, ice admiral uses is not the one that I just told you it was because that is an unawakened version. It's actually a different move. So let me let me just uh, let me just do some damage to him. Uh, so it's not that move. Why is he just standing still? Are you broken? What what what, what are you doing? It's not that move. It's his other move that he uses. I'm actually going to use my uh, thing right now so I don't die. Nope, it's not that move either. It's that move right there. Now, you might be thinking, stud, that looks just like the Glacial Surge move. But the Glacial Surge looks a lot different from that one. They are very similar moves, but that one has been removed from the game. That one is a different one. And you might say, well, stud, it's the Unawakened. It's actually not that one either. This goober is going to actually use the move. So I'm going to use mine, Glacial Surge, and then he's going to use his his is gonna be a little bit smaller yeah it doesn't look like these the ice shards on it are super jagged so it is a deleted move but yeah you know what that one that one's all right that one's kind of cool so let's move on to an even cooler one. all right this next boss i actually did before in a different video but you know i might as well just show it again because it is pretty cool and that boss is fajita and yeah i actually showed this one before but he uses the old version of the gravity fruit check this out all right i'm gonna, I'm gonna just smack him a little bit so he comes after me and he uses some pretty cool moves Moves. All right, come on. Use your moves. Use your moves. Use your moves. What are you doing, Goober? Okay, there's one of them right there. But he has an even cooler one where he spawns in like meteors from outer space. And I actually am using this because this guy actually does a lot of damage for a second C boss. Okay, wait. Yeah, this is it right here. Look at that, dude. <laughs> and yeah, I actually showed this in my last video, but I just think this one's so cool. We had to show it again for anybody that didn't watch the last video. And uh, if you want to see even more uh, of these like crazy things in Blocks Fruits, check out the last video that we did on this. Oh, this guy use the freaking thing again but okay let's go to the third seat and cover ones that we have not covered before these ones are brand new and yeah obviously a lot of you guys might be commenting right now stud you missed the don swan boss and he uses the old thing well yeah you're right but we did that in the last video so check out that video if you want to see a bunch of other ones that use deleted fruits but we're gonna go to the third seat and we're gonna check out some more that use deleted things and uh yeah these ones get pretty cool as well but all right we just arrived to the third seat and let's check out this next boss and we we don't actually have to hop in our boat this time because this boss is just at the back of this island right over here and he should be yep he's right there and yeah he actually uses the bomb fruit how do i not have the bomb fruit unlocked i literally have every other fruit in the game but i don't have the bomb fruit permanent what the heck okay there we go okay so check this out this guy has the old version of the bomb fruit so i'm gonna you know what i'm just gonna you know maybe use the bomb fruit on him first oh there we go there was one of the moves he's throwing like a rock at me bro what is that okay i have no idea what move set that would have been from i think it's a bomb because it explodes yeah that's like the old bomb move set all right let's see what other moves he has though okay yeah what was that that's gotta be like an old bomb move wait no no that's not it that's not it that's not it no yeah that's an old bomb move too okay this guy has a lot of old moves i didn't even realize that a lot of people forget about the stone all right a lot of people forget about this guy don't forget about this guy he's got a drippy chain all right he's a pretty cool dude all right let's do some more damage let's see if he has any other moves okay yep there's his little bomb throw and then he has has 
one little bomb combo like that. I think those might be his only two bomb moves. I wonder if these were like the first bomb moves that were added to Blocks Fruits. That's actually really interesting. If you guys know the answer to that, comment it down below because I'm very curious. But okay, let's move on to the next boss. And this boss uses a pretty insane one. So uh, we do need to hop back in our boat for this one. So let's make our way back to the docks. And yeah, shout out to all the goobers for helping me uh, figure out some of these fruits and also for driving me around in this boat. You guys are the best. And like I said, if you guys want to join and be in videos like this one, join the Discord, discord.gg slash goobers and hit subscribe. All right, we arrived to the boss and the last boss is of course, the freaking longma and i equipped the sword that the longma uses because you can see that our swords look you know definitely like a de they're, they're the same sword it's the tushita but if you look at how my sword works you can see it looks very different than what this one's gonna look like so i'm gonna just start uh comboing this tushita goober up this freaking longma all right let's see if it's gonna use one of the moves on me okay yeah what yeah that's right i'm gonna hit you with your own sword goober <laughs> okay wait okay so that's black and red and then mine is black red and it's got white in it so yeah that is definitely different okay what was that that one was definitely different than the one that i used okay so yeah they changed the vfx for it a lot and if you want to see a full video on me showing all of the different bosses that use deleted sword moves all right hop aboard boys hop aboard boys let's go and while we're on the way to find this verse boss make sure to hit that subscribe button we are getting close to 50,000 subscribers all right there we go we're arriving to the first island which is where we're gonna find our first boss which uses a remove fruit or not really removed a completely reworked fruit and that boss is of course the magma admiral which is already st starting to try to beat up some of the goobers look at him he's just dodging him but all right let's check out some of these old magma moves so as you can see that magma move looks nothing like what the modern magma moves look like and boys that move is actually supposed to be the old z move this move right here and yeah as you can tell it is very different this version of the magma fruit that this boss is using is a very old version that's no longer in the game dude look at this goober he's just trying to throw punches at me oh my gosh now he's beating up this guy all right and then he actually has another move which is like a, a magma fist come on come on fist me already oh i mean just like that look at that so he shoots like a magma fist now i'm not sure which one of these that's supposed to be i don't know if it's supposed to be this one is this a, is this a fist that i'm writing on right now i can't tell it might be based or it might be kind of like that move but yeah you can actually not use any of those moves anymore because that is an old like a uh, pre-reworked version of magma and let's also not forget the fact that after i cover these fruits i'm gonna show you guys some bosses that use literally deleted fruits but all right me and the goobers have now arrived at the second seed which is where we can find our next boss which uses a completely old version of a fruit and that boss is located right here on the green zone island bro oh my gosh they are they are way faster than me go goobers hold on you guys are literally outrunning me right now but all right if we go on the other side of green island over here there is like a meteor impact site right here and there he is there is the boss the fajita boss but this boss uses an old version of the gravity fruit which uh, Mr. Noob has right here. Yo, that fruit actually looks insane. But yeah, let's actually check out some of his moves and then compare them to the new gravity moves. Bro, oh my gosh, he is just comboing up this goober. Yo, chill. Okay, so that's one of the moves right there. Now, uh, Mr. Noob, do you do you have a uh, do you have gravity that you could like show us what uh what the old fruit looked like? Yeah, look, that's the brand new version of the move. All right, so that's the old version of the move, and that's the new version of the move. They're, they look very similar, but this next move actually looks insanely different. All right, now we need to we need to bait out this freaking uh, goober, this fajita boss, into actually hitting us with his freaking ultimate move. All right, wait. Yup, there it is. There's the move. So this is the move that uh you know uh the the gravity fruit used to have. And Mr. Noob, do you have the do you have the the new version of that move? Yeah, this is the new version right here. It looks way cooler. Now a lot of bosses actually use like old versions of moves. I don't know if you guys knew that. I feel like a lot of people know that. All right, ow, bro, the boss uses the meteor shower move again. But in this video, I'm pretty much just covering some of the coolest moves that were reworked. But okay, that's pretty much it for this fajita boss. Let's go ahead and combo him up really quick, just to destroy him really quickly. And boom. But all right, now I'm going to show you guys one more boss that had its moves completely revamped. And after that, I'm going to show you a boss that has a fruit that is literally not in the game. It has never been in the game. So let's go ahead and set sail for the third C. But all right, there we go. Me and the Goobers have now made it to the third C. And our next boss that uses a completely revamped fruit is actually the Island Empress. And we can actually just go into this portal right here and go straight to her. Okay, there she is. All right, so check this out. So the Island Empress actually uses an older version of the love fruit. See, check this out she wow, oh my gosh that did a lot of damage but yeah as you can see she uses an older version of the love fruit which mr noob has right there oh my gosh wait are they eating the love fruit are they about to kill 
the island empress with the new version of the love fruit all right but right there that's one of the moves that they used to have and this is one of the brand new love fruit moves that they added all right so i'm pretty sure her what that move right there used to be the z move and now the z move looks like that which is arguably way cooler whoa what move was that i think that used to be the c move and, and now the c move looks like this which is really cool <laughs> so yeah as you can see these moves like have been completely revamped and the only way that you can actually see any character in the game using moves like that like i'm pretty sure that used to be the uh the x move but yeah now, now the x move looks like this which uh which is arguably way cooler but yeah all right goobers we've seen it up murder her dude oh my god just absolutely destroyed her right now all right you know what i'll pitch in I'll, I'll help him too oh my gosh bro i can't even see anything all right there we go we defeated the freaking uh the island empress with the old love fruit with her very own fruit the love fruit but all right now it's time for us to finally explore the bosses that use completely deleted fruits and fruits that have been uh never even available to use in blocks fruits all right but boom we are now back on the first sea to explore a boss that has a fruit that has never even been able to been used in blocks fruits at any point ever and this fruit literally allows you to to fart. But okay, let's go ahead and hop in this boat and head to the next island, which is Fountain Island. But all right, there we go. We just arrived at the Fountain Island and our next boss is located right here. And that boss is called the Cyborg. All right, there he is, bro. This is probably one of the goofiest bosses in all of Bloxers, bro. Look at this, man. Look at this guy. And this boss actually has a ton of like, just like weird moves. And yeah, one of them, I'm pretty sure is literally just him farting. Yeah, he just farted on me. Okay. <laughs> he literally just farted on me. Unless that was Mr. Noob. That could have been Mr. Noob too. I don't know. But yeah, guys, imagine if there was like an actual fruit in the game that you could like fart with. That would be insane, bro. He's literally just farting everywhere. And the crazy thing is this boss not only can fart on you, but he can also shoot missiles at you. Okay, he farted on me again, bro. All right, let's see if we can get him to start shooting missiles at me. I'm, I'm, I'm going to get him a little bit low. Let's see. Let's see if he'll shoot a missile at me. All right, let's see if he shoots a missile. Let's see if he shoots a missile. Come on, I dare you. Oh, yo, he's shooting missiles now. Yeah, look at that. <laughs> Yo, yeah, this boss literally has abilities that you can't even get in the game. And the cyborg arc actually has one more move where he actually like extends his arm out and like punches you. Oh, right there. He just punched right there. So yeah, he can literally punch you from range. He can fart on you and he can shoot missiles. Yeah, this is definitely the weirdest boss in blocks for him. But okay, enough of getting freaking farted on. Uh, Goobers, you can murder him now. Um, It is now time for us to see the two bosses that literally use deleted fruits in blocks fruit. So let's go ahead and go to this next boss, which actually uses a deleted fruit. And this fruit that's been deleted is the deleted string fruit. Oh my gosh, I'm gonna drown. I'm gonna drown. All right, let me in the boat. Let me in the boat. Brother, try to leave without me. All right, and the location of this next boss is up on top of this castle right here in the second C. I don't know if you consider this a castle or a building. I don't know. But if we go ahead and enter this building and go down the stairs right here, then we encounter the Swan, Dawn Swan boss battle. And this Dawn Swan boss actually uses an old version of the spider fruit that was called the string fruit. I'm actually gonna go ahead and equip the spider fruit really quickly. Okay, there we go. And check out the different moves that this Dawn Swan boss has. Look at this. This. that is insane all right and this boss actually uses this heavy punishment move that is a string or a spider fruit move oh my gosh you chill all right come on use the move on me i dare you don swan oh my gosh yeah, that move right there is actually this heavy punishment move right here. So he still does use one of the updated uh, spider fruit moves. But that move right there is one of the old string fruit moves. So that move has literally been deleted from blocks fruits. And the fruit that he's using has been removed as well. Well, technically, it's kind of based off of the uh, the spider fruit. But it is technically a different fruit. All right, boys. Murder Don Swan. Dude, oh my gosh, bro. Every single time I tell them to murder any character like my whole screen starts shaking and exploding but all right now it's time for us to explore the last boss which uses a legitimately removed fruit that is no longer in the game which is the one and only kilo admiral and yeah if you guys couldn't already tell this boss right here still uses the kilo fruit even though it's been removed from the game all right come on use a kilo fruit move on me use a kilo fruit i haven't seen a kilo fruit being used in blocks fruits in such a long time right there that was one of them yeah, right there. That's another one of the Kilo moves, bro. Dude, it's a so weird seeing a boss use Kilo since Kilo got removed in the update number 20, bro. It's been so long since I've seen a Kilo been used. But yeah, some of the Kilo moves that the Kilo Admiral uses are that move right there, which was the C move. 
that move right there, which was the X move. And yeah, I'm pretty sure those are the only two moves that this boss knows how to use. So uh, now, now that we've seen uh, this boss's deleted fruit that's no longer in the game, Goobers, murder. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh, I can't see anything. Bro, they're just absolutely destroying this Kilo Admiral. Oh my gosh, bro. I can't even see. But anyways, boys, shout out to the goobers that were in this video. They are all members from my Discord, which uh, if you want to be in a video like this one, make sure to join the Discord. The Discord link is discord.gg slash goobers. All right, boys, so I'm back on Roblox Blocks Fruits. And boys, update 20 just came out, so you already know I'm going to unlock everything that there is in update 20. And boys, in this video, I'm going to be unlocking the brand new mammoth fruit. I'm going to be unlocking all of the different abilities that this mammoth fruit has. And then I'm going to try to use it in PvP and see how good it actually is. But before the video actually starts, I want to go ahead and give away one mammoth fruit to somebody who commented, subscribed, and liked the video on the last video. All right, I'm going to go ahead and give it to my boy Stayblade09 because he commented Goober and is subscribed. All right, so I went ahead and found my boy Garu right here, which is the person that left the comment on the last video. He said, no way. <laughs> All right, but let me go ahead and go into shop and let's go down to the mammoth fruit. And then we'll go ahead and gift this to my boy. Stay Blade 09. All right, and then boom, there we go. He said, no way, thank you so much. Hey, no problem, bro. Thanks for leaving a comment on the last video. Hey, he said, subscribe to Sun. Hey, you should hit that subscribe button. And boy, since I'm unlocking the mammoth fruit in this video as well, I'm gonna go ahead and give away the mammoth fruit to another person that comments, likes, and subscribes on this video. All right, but now that we've actually given away the fruit, it is time for us to head back to the third C so that we can start unlocking this brand new mammoth fruit. All right, and boom, we are now back on the third C. And boys, I actually already bought the Mammoth Fruit uh, because I wanted to see what it did when I was making my update video. But when I equip it, as you can see, I do not have any mastery. The only move that I have right now is a move called Ancient Cutter. And I'm not gonna lie, guys, this move is pretty cool. Let me go ahead and show you. It spawns in like a ghost mammoth that you can shoot at somebody and it does a ton of damage. But boys, that's literally only the first move. We have to unlock all of the different moves. Hey, all right, buddy. All right, you little goober, where are you? Get, get over here. You think you can just come after me like that and me not notice, huh? You think you can get away with doing that, you little goober? <laughs> Alright, but anyways, boys, it is time for me to start grinding. So let me go ahead and get the goober squad in the server. And boys, if you want to be a part of the goober squad and help me grind for stuff for videos, make sure to join my Discord. The link will be down in the description of this video. But okay, I'm pulling up to the sea castle where I'm gonna pick up my goobers. Alright, where are they, bro? They need, to, they need to hop on this boat so we can actually go and start beating some bosses so I can get some mastery. All right, they're finally, they're finally coming these freaking goobers, bro. <laughs> All right, hop on the boat, boys. Let's go. Let's, it's time, it's time to grind for some levels. All right, but let me go ahead and go into the shop and uh, we got to respawn the bosses so that we can actually get some levels really quickly. All right, and we have arrived to our first boss, which is the Cake Queen. All right, we're going to start this off with the first move, the Ancient Cutter move. And dude, that does a decent amount of damage. I'm not going to lie. All right, and, but we, we've got to do some more damage as well. Oh my gosh, bro. I just got knocked out of the freaking ice cream cone. Bro, we are absolutely dis disintegrating the cake queen right now. Let's go ahead and hit her up with that. Hit her with a little combo. Uh, boom. It's going to become a lot easier to do this once I actually get more moves for my mammoths. Because right now, I literally can only hit them with my mammoth move, the ancient cutter. All right, let me hit the ancient cutter move again. There we go. Oh, and there we go. Okay, it, she has been defeated. Let's see how many master I get just from killing the boss one time. Okay, we already got our second move. We got our true prehistoric punt move and our colossal crusher move. Hey, yeah, like I said, you could join the goobers and help me grind these bosses if you join the discord which the link will be down below bro look at this freaking goose man look at this look at this freaking goose guy right here hey why are you hitting at me this guy's got drip though look at him he's got the zombie face yeah this guy that this is the only one with the real drip right here but okay let's go ahead and move on to the next boss where i'm going to show you guys these brand new moves that i just unlocked all right i said go next boss we are on our way to fight the next boss which will be at the great tree all right but let me go ahead and activate my hockey and let's start using these brand new moves all right so so we've got the ancient cutter which does 2700 damage not bad but now this is a brand new move called the true prehistoric punt all right so we're gonna do this and go boom all right i i i i completely missed 
All right, you know what? We're going to try to use the Colossal Crusher instead. All right, where is this boss, bro? I literally can't even see it. All right, the Colossal Crusher. Here we go. Wow, boom. Oh, my gosh. We literally just, like, took them and hit them against the wall. All right, let's use this one now, too. All right, 2,700. Not bad. We'll go ahead and hit it with another Colossal Crusher. Knock him up against the wall. And then we'll do the true prehistoric punt again and end it with the Crusher. And there we go. Oh, I got an item drop. Okay, bet. Oh, did I not unlock any new moves, bro? Oh, my next move unlock is at Mastery 200. All right, you know what? We got to do a little little bit of grinding. All right, we're going to go ahead and kill some more bosses, and then I'm going to cut back to when I unlock this next move, which is called Stampede. All right, and there we go. I just unlocked my new skill. Ooh, and I got an item drop again. All right, we have our new skill, which is called Stampede, and it's an F ability, so I'm assuming that it's going to be like a travel ability. Let me test this out. All right, we're going to move on to the next boss, but to get to the next boss, which is going to be inside of this tree right here, I'm going to use the Stampede move to do... Wait, hold on, bro. What is this? Oh, wait. Wait, what what is about to happen bro what is about to happen okay bro what okay that is not a travel move i thought that would be like a travel move i was completely wrong but okay you know what i'm gonna go ahead and grind this out so you guys don't have to watch me and then i'm gonna show you guys all of these different moves and this crazy transformation move that i unlock at mastery 300 all right so we're still like trying to level it up i'm only at mastery 218 but this boss is literally naked i think we found a bug bro look at him why why, why are you naked what what is going on it's time to die you freaking goober all right get over here let's go ahead and boom and hit him with the bop and then hit him with this move right here there we go bro put on a shirt man bro. why don't you have a shirt on Wah, boom there we go and then we'll hit it with the stampede move to finish it off all right there we go we got rid of the freaking naked goober bro i, I don't even know what's going on anymore <laughs> Okay, but anyways, as you can see, I now have my mastery to 294, so I almost have my transformation ability where I can become the mammoth. So let me go ahead and get some damage in on this little goober here, so boom. And actually, I've figured out kind of how to use these moves pretty well, like uh, the Colossal Crusher like that. But the most overpowered is definitely the Stampede move. You can like charge it up like this, and then just shoot it towards where you want to go, and it does 3,000 damage. It's actually insane. And then look at this. Look at the combo we just did right there. Alright, I'm not gonna lie. I, uh, I totally didn't mess up the combo as soon as i said that but okay anyways let's go ahead and get this freaking kill on this goober wap boom charge up our stampede hit him with this wap boom there we go and then we can go ahead and hit them with the cutter boom there we go we'll hit him with that and then we'll go ahead and with the, hit him with the ancient crusher then we can hit him with the stampede and finish it off in there oh bro i'm literally one level away are you joking bro i'm literally just gonna go kill an npc at this point you know what get over here get over here you freaking goober die all right wap boom there we go oh bro i'm literally so close all right come over here little goober come here. All right, let's go ahead and hit him with that. There we go. And there we go. We unlocked my new skill. But okay, let me go ahead and make my way back to that brand new island that they just added. Let's go ahead and spawn the sentinel. Dude, this boat is so cool. All right, and sails away. Here we go. We're making our way back to the brand new island, which is over there. Look at that, dude. We're taking flight. That's so sick. But yeah, now we have all of our moves unlocked. The ancient cutter, the true prehistoric punt, the colossal crusher, the stampede move, and of course, our brand new transfer and yeah, guys, shout out to the goobers for helping me out so much. These little goobers right here. If you want to help me out in raids like this, or not raids, I'm, I'm a freaking goober. I mean, that's why I have the goober thing above my head. <laughs> but yeah, if you want to help me out, make sure to join the Discord. The link will be down below. But okay, we have finally arrived to the brand new island, and I want to go ahead and test out these brand new mammoth moves as the transformation. I really like how on this island, it literally just starts raining. I think that's so cool. All right, but I now have my test dummies right here, and we're going to test out these brand new moves with the transformation of the mammoth all right but here we go boys let me go ahead and click v and activate my transformation yo dude that's sick look at me bro i'm just i'm just walking around like i can literally just stomp on it wait oh yo i can hit it by doing m1s but okay now let me go ahead and test out the uh new moves all right so the stampede move all right what is this what is this i wonder if this like stuns him okay this is doing a ton of damage this is literally doing so much damage wait how much damage does it do does it just do like infinite damage bro what all right i'm gonna test out this next move which is ancient cutter so let me go ahead and do this and shoot it his way 1600 damage dude i feel like that's less damage than what it did before what oh yo i just watched the the mammoth is blinking bro oh my gosh okay but those are only two of the moves i still need to test out true prehistoric punt and colossal crusher all right let's check this one out all right here we go goose you might want to watch out all right, and boom, there we go. Hold on, let me test this out one more time. True prehistoric punt. Uh, all right, it, yeah, it barely does any damage. I feel like the point of that one is to stun them. But okay, let me go ahead and use the Colossal Crusher move now. 
And boom! Yeah, I feel like that's not like a ton of damage. What if I like jump and do it though? If I jump up in the air and then I use it? Okay, that did. All right, that does more damage. Okay, bet. And then we've got the jump. Let me see. Does the jump do damage like Buddha? Okay, the jump doesn't do damage like Buddha, but you can jump so high. Bro, look at how high I jump. I literally just jumped out of the arena. But what does the stampede? Oh, dude, look at this. Look at how sick this is. And this just like lasts forever. Like you can literally just keep on doing this forever and just do a ton of damage. Like if you just wanted to do like kill like NPCs, you could literally just like sit on top of them like this and look how much damage I'm doing. I'm doing so much damage on this. I don't even see where the NPC is, bro. Oh my gosh. But yeah, boys, that's pretty much this new fruit that they added. Now what I want to do is I actually want to troll my friend with it because my friend has not seen this fruit yet and I actually want to see what his reaction is to uh, me using this crazy new fruit in Blocks Fruits. All right, so I got my friend in the game, Mr. Poop Shot. Where are you? Picking out your cat for the reason. Oh, bro, what? You're so fit. Oh, what's up, stud? What's up, man? <laughs> what was that? What's up? I was singing my favorite song. What's up? Oh, um, yeah, I just, uh, I just wanted to challenge you to a 1v1 really quick, okay? I'm just, I'm gonna use, uh, I'm gonna use, like, a fruit. It's not that good, though. Okay, I actually have not played this game in, like, months. Um, okay. All right, bad, bad, bad. You know this game just updated, though, right? Wait, what level are you? Uh... I'm not max. I'm actually not max level anymore. I'm 1,500. So if uh, I if, yeah, if, bro, if just I come up you on me, bro. You'll definitely have a chance to win. Come here. I I don't think I will. All right, Mr. Busha, are you ready? Three, two, one, go. What, ah! <laughs> what is that? What is that? Bro, Mr. Busha, are you come a here. Mammoth? What the heck is that? Come here. No, stop. Come stop. here, no Mr. Stop, 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 stop. Come How do here. I come other fruits? I forgot to come, come other here, fruits. Mr. No. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Mr. Bouchard, listen, listen. All right, I'll love you when you get, but this time I won't I won't become a mammoth, okay? Yeah, you've never lied to me before. Yeah, I would so. I would never lie about anything, Mr. Do you like my sword, by the way? It's so skibbity. No, no. It's so phantom <laughs> tax. All right, are you ready? Uh, no. All right, not go. Actually. Go. Wait, how do I? No, how do I equip a different fruit? Dude, it's Mastery 49. <laughs> <laughs> All right, you know what, Bouchot? All right, go. You can get the first hit. Bro forgot to turn on his PvP. All right, Mr. Bouchot, three, two, one, go. Come here, stop. Yeah. What? I missed. Wait. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, 14 damage. Come here. Stupid idiot. Come here. <laughs> you freaking jerk! You told me you were gonna do that! Bro, I did what it! What are you talking about? I'm not a man. Look, this is the mammoth. <laughs> Yo, it does damage when you equip it. I don't even know that. Alright, wait, listen. I'm turning off the mammoth. I'll turn it off. Bro, stop cheating. You're actually annoying. <laughs> like, Alright, go. Like, I'm scared of you now. I want to stay over here, man. I, I want... Hey! Ow! What the? Oh my gosh! Stop! 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 Chill! 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 Oh my gosh! <laughs> Let's go! I don't want to play with you anymore. You know what? I'm what? leaving. Bro, bro. You're so phantom text. Okay. You're all so right. Scary. Okay. Okay. But anyways, boys, if you enjoyed this video and you want to see some more Blockstruz videos just like this one, make sure to subscribe. And I actually have a second channel that I'm going to be posting Blockstruz on as well. So make sure to hit the subscribe button and uh, make sure to subscribe to that channel as well. Hey guys, 80 or 90% of you guys are still not subscribed yet. So if you're not subscribed yet, make sure to hit that subscribe button. But anyways, boys, I'll see you guys in the next video. And adios. All right, boys, so I'm back on Roblox Blocks Fruits. And in the last video, I unlocked one of the coolest fruits that I didn't even know was super cool. And that fruit was the Control Fruit. But in this video, me and the Goobers are going to be unlocking a fruit that might even be cooler than the Control Fruit that we unlocked in the last video. You gotta be kidding me. And that fruit is the Spirit Fruit. And if you didn't know, this Spirit Fruit was one of the only fruits in Blocks Fruits to not get a model update in the most recent Blocks Fruit update so in this upcoming update this spirit fruit might get even more overpowered look one of the goobers is mewing right now <laughs> but all right let's go ahead and start this journey and start unlocking my spirit fruit let's eat this fruit and there we go we now have the evil side and the light side and as you can see i have mastery 64 on this fruit so that means i only have one move unlocked but in this video i'm gonna get this fruit all the way to mastery 350 and unlock the end of times move but all right, before I go ahead and start unlocking all of these different fruits, let's see what the Blocks Fruits gotcha can give me. Usually, he does not give me very good luck. All right, bye. Come on, give me something good. Oh, yo, we actually got the life fruit. Yeah, that's actually kind of fire. You know, I'm going to go ahead and give it to whichever one of the goobers uh, can unlock or can can grab this fruit the quickest. All right, who's going to get it? Oh, he got it first. Oh, the guy that was mewing. I said, I hope he didn't break your mewing streak to get the fruit. Okay, good. He's still mewing. Okay, awesome. 
But all right, let's go ahead and see what our first move actually does. It's called Frostfire Grass. The user mounts on an angel buddy and flies towards the position of their cursor. Then the user summons in an ice block that damages and stuns people. Hmm, I, I want to see what this looks like. Uh, well, we'll test it out of this boss over here. All right, goobers, follow me. We're going to start leveling up this fruit. And uh, actually, the boss has not spawned in yet. So let me go ahead and uh, respawn bosses. All right, boom, there we go. And all right, let's see what this first move looks like. All right, let's see. Okay, let's see. All right, we're gonna dash towards it. Okay, yeah, and then it puts him inside of an ice block. That's sick. Wait, how much damage did that do? I'm not gonna lie. I, I completely forgot to look at how much damage it did. All right, let's see how much damage this does. Okay, so we can charge it up. Okay, 3,700. Yo, that's actually insane. That's actually a lot of damage for just our Z move, our mastery number one move. Ah! Bro, just put me inside of a freaking tornado, bro. All right, you know what? I'm not gonna take that disrespect. Goobers! Kill him. All right, let's see. Okay, we trapped him in ice again. <laughs> Wait, hold on. Somebody else, I think, might have the spirit fruit, too. I think that's one of the spirit fruit moves. Oh, yeah, that's going to be sick when we unlock that later in this video. Oh, wait. Did I spawn that in? Wait. Whoa, I can click? <laughs> Okay, hold on. I did not know that I could click. I could click and spawn in like little buddies. What is that? Wait, hold on. I might need to check the wiki and see what is going on because I actually have no idea. Oh, yo, this dude's almost dead. You're dead, buddy. Get out of here. Bop, there we go. And we got a new skill unlocked. But okay, hold on. I need to see what the heck just happened, bro. All right, the tap move. Summons heavenly buddies if the bar is blue and hellish buddies if the bar is on the red oh that's crazy how did i not know that so wait, if i click now it'll spawn in a hellish buddy that's a hellish buddy and then that's a heavenly buddy that's a hellish buddy so the heavenly buddies look like little stars or like a little fly it's a flying pig all right that's actually so cool i did not know that it did that but look we now have our second move unlocked all right. Oh, wait, hold on. I just realized that these glow in the dark. Oh, that's cool. Yo, this is actually so sick, bro. It actually looks insane at night. It looks even cooler in the nighttime. But okay, let's see what this sky ruler move does according to the wiki. Okay, so it shows some videos. It looks like it's like a fly move. Oh, you can fly on top of one of your buddies. That's sick. So wait, if I spawn in, let's say I want to I want to fly on this guy. If I spawn in that and then I use sky ruler. Oh, wait, what? Wait, wait hold on. Let's see. I spawned in, I spawned in two of these guys so it should make me okay yeah there we go now i can fly on top of my evil buddy dude that's sick okay and you know what we're just gonna fly to our next boss and start unlocking some more of these moves and i'm not i'm not gonna lie i don't think this move uh it really is that useful you know the other moves were pretty cool but uh this move was it's probably not gonna be very useful when fighting other goobers in this game but okay let's head to the next boss which is the beautiful pirate wait i wonder if we could kill this boss with just the spirits all right let's see i'm just gonna start placing spirits around where the boss is all right Spirit there. Spirit there. Oh, I'm doing damage. I'm doing damage. I'm actually doing damage, dude. <laughs> no way. Okay, I'm putting one there. Wait, where is it? Dude, they keep hitting the boss like further away. Bro, look at all my spirits everywhere. There's <laughs> just a bunch of frogs. I'll right, start combo wamboing her up. But you know what? We're getting a little bit low too. So let's get some more of our health back with our sanguine art style. I'm gonna start spawning these things everywhere. Okay, I'm just gonna spawn them and run around her in a circle. I just keep running. How much damage can we actually do? Dude, we're doing so much damage. Oh my gosh. Wait, yeah. Come, come walk through all of my buddies. Yo, we're doing a bunch of damage literally just by running around all right and now she's gonna walk towards me so i'm just gonna spawn in a bunch of these guys and just start walking away will, will it do damage will it do damage okay i'm just gonna walk over here come on please please can we kill this boss with just my buddies we've already done 2000 wait no 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 way she wait how low is she she's so low oh my gosh come on we have we have to we have to kill her we have to kill her with these bosses come on come on buddy you've got this kill the beautiful pirate wait Hold on, I'm just now realizing something. The cursed spirits are the ones that do damage. Okay, so if I want to do damage to the pirate, I have to spawn in only cursed spirits. And there we go! Bro, the frog just ate her! <laughs> Dude, that's sick! Okay, all right, I'm learning more and more as I go. This is actually very useful information that I'm getting right here. Wait, let me check the wiki, because I realized that the cursed spirits do damage, but what do the light spirits do? Okay, yeah, the star heals you every two to five seconds, and the pig gives you a temporary speed boost oh that's crazy all right the mushroom sprouts out poisonous gas the toad pulls players in with this tongue and pretty much eats them and then the cursed tree summons roots that stuns nearby enemies yo this fruit's actually crazy dude this fruit's actually really cool well why are they farting over there bro what are you doing oh and they just farted on me again okay i'm going to the next boss i'm not, I'm not gonna deal with this 
All right, I'm going to kill this boss really quickly because I want to see what this next move that we're going to unlock is going to look like. And I kind of have this strategy of using this fighting style and then just healing myself whenever it does damage. I'm not going to lie. It's a pretty overpowered strategy. It's almost like having Buddha. All right, let's hit him with this move right there. And then we'll spawn in some cursed spirits to uh, just absolutely do some damage for me. Look at all the cursed spirits, bro. Oh my gosh, dude. Dude, we just made a forest. We just made a freaking forest. That's insane. Oh, wait, they killed <laughs> They killed the boss! <laughs> nah, these... No, these, these spirits are actually overpowered. That's insane. Wait a second. I just realized that I have my next move unlocked called Wrath of Ra. Yo, so you're telling me I could have used that move this whole time. You know, I actually didn't even need to use it because uh, my little spirits just destroyed that boss. But all right, let's go ahead and start making our way to the next boss so we can continue to level up our fruit. All right, let's go ahead and spawn ourselves in a boat so we can head over and fight the Cake Queen, aka Mango Pool's girlfriend. And while we're on our way to that, I want to see what my next move, the Wrath of Ra, does. Oh, that looks insane, bro. What is that? All right, it says the Uter sends a demon buddy to the position of the cursor. You can hold down this item to make it reach further. Ooh, that's good to know. And the demon buddy explodes into a pillar of fire, damaging enemies and launching four fiery balls into the air. Okay, that's actually really good to know. Oh, wait, well, we we've arrived. We've arrived to fight the Kate Queen. And all right, let's see what our first move looks like, the Wrath of Ra. Oh, my gosh. 5,000, 6,000 damage? Dude, that's actually insane, dude. <laughs> and you know what? I'm not even gonna like worry about like getting like you know hitting the boss anymore i'm just gonna keep spawning in these cursed spirits and they're just gonna take care of this boss for me i'm not even hitting them and i've done 10,000 damage so far this might be one of the best grinding fruits in the game look it literally just gets the cake queen stuck in place 17,000 damage oh my gosh bro that's insane all right come on come on yes <laughs> yo let's go oh my gosh no this might be one of my favorite fruits but okay sadly we actually did not unlock lock a move that time uh we still just need to kill it looks like dude they're farting on me again i think we just need to kill one more boss and we should get this wrath of shoe move so let's go ahead and move on to the next boss and let's see if we can unlock this move by killing one more boss all right so we arrive to the next boss and let's just start spamming these bosses and see what happens again all right i think if i actually bring the hydra inside this building and i just start spamming all of these different of uh, spirits i should be able to kill this island empress with just spirits dude this is gonna be insane this is gonna be actually insane. Wait, the Empress is actually so low right now. The Empress is actually getting so low. Come on, you got this tree. You got this frog. All right, I think I just finished off with that move. And there we go. We have our new skill. No. And I actually want to see what this move does before I actually try to use it. Hey, yo, what the heck? A fruit just spawned in the game. All right, we're gonna head towards this fruit really quick and see what this is. Maybe it's the shadow fruit or the gravity fruit because those are the only two mythical fruits that I haven't unlocked yet, which by the way, hit subscribe if you want to see me unlock those next. All right, let's go ahead and fly towards the fruit. Let's see what it is. Oh, there it is. It looks like it's blue. And it's... Yo, is that Quake? Yo, that's actually sick. All right, but let me go ahead and store this fruit. And let's start grinding for this final spirit move called End of Time. All right, but I have now arrived to fight my final boss. Because I have my mastery all the way to 349, which means we only need one more level. So let's head to the back of the island and challenge this last boss. All right, so the Wrath of Shoe move should be the one where I stop on this one. Yeah, and it creates a stud, dude. That's insane. I'm killing you with just spirits, buddy. But all right, let's do a little combo to finish him off. Let's freeze and hit him with this move. And then we should be able to hit him with that move right after that. And there we go. We now have the final move unlocked. Yes! All right, but now that I have every single move unlocked for the spirit fruit, I'm going to test out this final move on one of the goobers. Which, by the way, if you want to be in a video like this one, make sure to join the Discord. The link is discord.gg slash goobers. But all right, let's see what this final move does. Actually, hold on. I need to check the wiki and see what it says. Oh my gosh, wait. It's both. The user commands both Angel Buddy and Demon Buddy to shoot a beam of ice and a beam of fire towards their cursor. Stunning enemies. The two beams will merge, creating a large ice explosion that shakes the user screed and stuns them oh my gosh we've unlocked our z move we've unlocked our x move we've unlocked our c move and we've also unlocked our spirits and our flying move but now it's finally time to use our final move all right here we go the end of times our final move bro look at that <laughs> No, that's actually crazy. Yo, thank you, Goober, for letting me uh, use you as my dummy. But boys, if you want to see me unlock even more 
fruits like the gravity or the shadow fruit hit subscribe we just hit 50,000 subscribers on this channel and i'm gonna try to unlock every single item in roblox blocks fruits but i'll see you boys in the next video all right boys so we're back on blocks fruits and boys over the last few times i played blocks fruits i became different characters i became skibbity toilet with the buddha fruit and i also became grimace with the venom fruit and in my last video i told you guys to comment what character i should become next and boys one comment got almost 100 likes who wants stud to become kaido and boys if you guys don't already know who that is that is one of the strongest characters from the one piece anime and it's also the person who uses the dragon fruit so in this video i'm gonna be going from my little zombie self to a fully unlocked dragon fruit user and boys by the end of this video i'm going to become kaido and boys if you watched my last video you saw that we actually unlocked this dragon fruit by <laughs> spitting a fruit oh my gosh no way bro we just got a freaking dragon fruit oh my gosh that's insane so let's see maybe we'll get something good again would you like to buy a random fruit buy oh dude we got the bomb fruit but okay boys let's go ahead and eat this freaking dragon fruit and boom there we go as you can see at the bottom of our screen we now have the dragon fruit activated and yeah we only have mastery one so uh yeah we're gonna have to do some grinding but okay let me go ahead and test out what this first move does it's called heat wave beam okay that looks kind of sick bro look at my whole character he's like glowing and then let's shoot it at this tree let's see oh it just completely blew up the tree that is kind of sick but okay you already know what time it is we need to go to the third c so we can take out some third c bosses to get our mastery all the way up to uh mastery 350 oh my gosh bro <laughs> yeah you have to have so much mastery for this fruit. This is going to take forever. <laughs> And boys, while I'm on my way to the third C, if you guys like playing Blocks Fruits, Combat Warriors, or any other like Roblox anime games, then join my Discord because we just added a bunch of cool new channels to the server. And also, boys, comment what character I should become next down below. But yeah, boys, it is time for us to make our way to the first boss, which is going to be on that island way over there. And yeah, I think killing this boss should give us enough mastery to unlock a few of our moves. We might be able to unlock Draconic Claw or Dragon Flight. And once we do get to 350 mastery, we're going to be able to transform into kaido and of course the ice cream cone is home to big mob let me go ahead and drag in these nuts all right but here we go heat wave beam let's see how much damage this does almost 3,000 damage not bad okay chill chill and yeah we're gonna have to use our god human a little bit here to fight the uh the freaking cake queen big mob just because uh, she does a ton of damage bop boom pow all right, boys, and just like that, we have almost defeated the freaking Kate Queen. Get over here. And bop. <laughs> Dude, I desperately need to unlock some of these other moves, bro, because trying to beat this boss with only one move is not easy. Hey, bro, is she trying to riz me up right now, bro? What was that attack pink for? All right, you know what? One final move. I think this move should finish her off, and boom, there we go. Look at all of our freaking mastery levels coming in. Oh, my gosh, look at the mastery going up. It's so fast. <laughs> it's so fast. Oh, my gosh. Okay, it's, it's literally been like 10 seconds. It's still going, guys. It's literally still going are we gonna have two moves we did we unlocked two different moves but okay let's go to the next boss and see what these new moves do so we've got draconic claw and dragon flight so let me see what dragon flight does okay i've got these <laughs> these goofy green wings bro what is this <laughs> and then we've got draconic claw which is uh Oh, 3,000. Oh, and burn damage. 4,000, almost 5,000 damage. It's pretty good. Okay, chill. But okay, boys, I'm going to spare you the grinding. I'm going to go ahead and skip until I have all of these moves unlocked. So, you know what? Get out of here, you freaking goober. And boom, just like that, we have become Kaido, the freaking legendary dragon user. And uh, I think somewhere around here, there is a little furry. I don't know where he went. Um, <laughs> There he is. Hey! Okay, so as you can see, I have mastery 350 now, and uh, I have all of these different moves unlocked. Do you like my little green dragon wings? Yeah, but can you do this? <laughs> Bro, did you just fart? Kinda. Dude, what was that? Okay, okay, okay. So check this out. Our first move, of course, is heat wave bead. I already used this one. I just uh, smack him in the face with a big fireball. Did that feel good? I like it. Hot. Oh. Uh. -huh. uh Okay, and then, of course, the next move, which is called Fire Shower, which this one is actually insanely overpowered, as you can see. Uh, it's like a bunch of, like, uh, beams of freaking fire, bro. Like, we're literally breathing fire. But, boys, there is something called Transformation. And uh, there's something up here called a Furry Meter. I mean, Fury Meter. And, boys, watch what happens when I go ahead and use this Transformation move. 
I turned into a freaky dragon. Hey, hey, look at this. Now I'm just flying around. What's up, little furry boy? Look, now I'm a furry too. Let me ride you. Dude, ew. what? Dude, get away from me, bro. But boys, these moves get way cooler once you become this dragon. So check out this first move. Heat wave beam becomes a beam that literally shoots out of the dragon's mouth. It does a little bit more damage. And then the draconic claw move also looks insane. Check this one out. Oh my god. <laughs> Dude, I caught your first suit on fire again. And then, boys, the coolest move, which is fire shower. Check this out. Hold on. Since oh, you're no. a demon, you, you take no. showers and no. fire, right? No, no, no. Yeah? I'm Come here. Ready. Come here, little I'm furry ready. boy. Come here. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my gosh. Uh. <laughs> hey. You know what, buddy? It's super suck time. No. But okay, boys, I'm now in a public server, and I'm going to try to find some Luffy's to murder. And uh, if we look at the wall right here, we got a Luffy right here with a reward of 26,000 belly. But then if we go over to this side of the room, we've got another Luffy wanted that's got a reward of 26,000 belly as well. But yeah, we're going to try to find some Luffy users, and we're going to try to troll them by murdering them as Kaido. All right, is this a Luffy user right here? Is, is this Luffy right here? Yo, did we find our first Luffy? No way. What's up, little Luffy, man? What's up? Look, he's got his hockey. On. Yeah, look, it's our, it's our first Luffy. All right, let me see. Does he have his PvP on? Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh, we literally almost one shot him. We literally almost one shot him. Where did you go? Oh, he's right here. Watch this. Look at this. <laughs> but okay, we need to find a better battle. I kind of feel bad. You know what? Uh, yo, Luffy, I am so sorry. Do you want a free fruit? Okay, let's see. Let's see if he'll follow me into the lobby. And I, I'll, dude, I'll give him a free fruit. I kind of feel bad for uh, murdering him while he's trying to grind, bro. Since he's dressed up as Luffy, let's go ahead and gift him the rubber fruit. All right, let's go ahead and gift this man the fruit that he deserves. All right, there we go. 1,200 Robux. There we go. Gift a uh, permanent rubber. Bro, why are you running from me? I just gave you a free fruit come here he said thank you yeah dude i i feel bad i feel bad but okay now we need to go find a max level luffy and uh and take him on because we gotta find a more fair battle oh wait hold on bro there's literally a factory raid hold on let's see if we can do some damage in this factory raid let's go ahead and transform into our dragon mode and do a fire shower all right let's see how much damage we can do with this fire shower oh oh ow chill 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 we'll do another heat wave beam we'll do another fire shower here we go dude this does like an insane amount of damage, bro. That does. Oh, we killed. We killed somebody. I didn't even mean to kill anybody. We we'll use another draconic claw. Oh wait, we'll use another fire shower. Come on, let's go ahead and finish off this core. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. My my thing ran out. All right, come on. Finish off the core. Finish off the core. And there we go. Oh, but we didn't get a fruit, bro. We, we literally didn't get a fruit. But uh, dude, where did that freaking Luffy user go? I need to find him. Hey, yo, hold on. Is that the Luffy? Is that the Luffy? Hey. All right, we're gonna one v one. Me and um, wait, Luffy uses no fruit. Bro, what? Bro, what? You're supposed to be using rubber. Let's go ahead and transform. And hey, come here. Where, where are you, Luffy? Come here. Oh, 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 3,000 damage. Dude, literally, what is happening? What is happening? I can't even see my screen right now. Heat wave beam. There we go. Oh, oh my gosh. Did we just kill him in one shot again? Bro, that was literally a different Luffy too. This was the first Luffy and this was the second Luffy. Bro, Kaido is just too overpowered, bro. Oh my gosh. We are just destroying people. But boys, I feel like we were successful in becoming Kaido, bro. We literally murdered like different, so many different Luffys, bro. And I just remember that there is like a secret cool thing that you can do with the dragon fruit in blocks fruits. And I'm talking about like really cool. So I don't know if you guys have ever seen these little rings. These little rings are... Uh, at random places throughout like the third sea and boys check this out look what happens when i'm able to fly through them first of all as you can see i have purple wings right now earlier in this video uh they were freaking green that is because boys if i go ahead and fly through these different rings it changes the color of dragon that i become and uh you unlock these with different mastery and uh, as you can see with the the yellow it's 400 mastery the white is 500 and the black is 600 mastery and uh and dude the 600 mastery must take forever to unlock so if this video gets a thousand likes i will become the black dragon in blocks fruits so check this out i can become a freaking brown dragon dude look i'm the poop dragon i can become a freaking red dragon which looks actually probably probably like one of the coolest ones is the red dragon and boys i can even become a freaking purple dragon bro which this one looks like actually insane look look at this i even showed up purple lightning bolts dude oh my gosh anything below me is, is, is freaking dead now but yeah boys like i said uh these these three final colors if this video gets a thousand likes i will become the freaking yellow white and of the almighty black dragon
Boys, today I found out there is a way to make your sword massive in Blocks Fruits. I mean huge, bro. I mean, look at my sword. It's absolutely ginormous. And boys, I would tell you how to do this glitch, but uh, if you use it in public servers, you will get banned. But here's the thing. I think as long as I don't go in a public server and use it or use it to like level up in this game, I can use it without getting freaking banned, bro. Because if I got banned, you know, I, I would probably cry, <laughs> smash my computer, do some horrible things. And boys, I'm gonna use these huge swords to troll my friends in uh, 1v1s. I'm gonna trick them into fighting me, and then I'm gonna pull out these... Oh, wait, I guess they're not big anymore. Now they're just, you know, little swords. I'm gonna use these above-average-sized swords to troll them in 1v1s. So, yeah, this is gonna be pretty fun. And spoiler alert, one of them rage quit. And the coolest part about this glitch is that you can do it with multiple swords. You can have a massive dark blade like this one. You can have massive cursed dual katanas. And you can even have massive true triple katanas katanas like this all right and now we are in the third c which is where we're going to be taking out some of the biggest and hardest bosses to fight in this game with the massive swords but if you look right now these are just regular size swords like look at this this is just your regular average true triple katana nothing special to see here but not for long but let's go ahead and spawn in some of these bosses uh oh i i am broke uh <laughs> i don't have any robux uh all right, there we go. I got me some Robux. You know, just spent some money. My wallet is very upset with me right now. Bro. But the first boss we're going to fight is up in this massive tree. And boys, we're going to see if we can defeat this boss in record time with these massive swords. And boom, I took a magical pill and my swords grew super big. And now it's time to murder this little innocent person right here. Huh? Kilo Admiral, more like uh, you're about to die. All right, here we go. We're starting. All right, start the counter. The counter is on screen right now. I'm literally just going to keep flying around it like this. Oh no, that, that kind of things up wait a second wait do i not have my stats right bruh i have no points in sword i i'm literally an idiot but dude that still does like a decent amount of damage oh my gosh okay let me fix my stats <laughs> all right boys there we go yeah, we're gonna go ahead and do our refund and let's put our stats in melee defense and sword all right now we gotta go back to this kilo admiral and uh brutally murder them all right and the timer starts now boom there we go all right we're, we gotta hopefully move around quick enough so that they can't hit us and uh stun us because if they get it yeah see if they get us stun attack it'll slow down the time that uh, it takes to kill them okay let's see all right come on come on let me finish you off really quick come on let me finish you off come on well how much time do we have left how much time has it been i feel like this is like 10 seconds and boom there we go and that took uh i don't even know how long i'll put it on the screen right now but that is like record time fast like the only way that you could like get a time that fast is i feel like if you had like a buddha but let's go ahead and test this out on some other bosses and then what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna troll my friend with it and boys if you want a place where you can play a bunch of different games hang out trade fruit then boys you should definitely join my discord i added some new stuff for the summer because i know a lot of you guys are going to be playing a lot of games this summer all right boys i'm now on the third seat and i've got my above average size sword with me as you can see dude look at how long it is oh my god we're gonna need to make this sword even bigger if we're gonna be able to take out this next boss don't mind me just making my sword big taking a magical pill and there we go look at that that magical pill really worked bro look at how big my sword is but boys it is time to fight our next boss and our next boss is located up inside of this massive ice cream cone this is one of the hardest bosses to fight in the game and i'm gonna try to beat it with just this dark dagger all right here we go there she is all right let's see if we are able to take this cake queen out oh god wow that does a lot of damage it does a lot of damage i, I didn't even have my hot key on i'm stupid i'm stupid all right cake queen get over here here we go let's see if i can take her out now so i just have to be a little bit more careful i need to like constantly be running around around her like this and we should be able to take her out pretty easily actually wait the range on this is so crazy look at this look at how far away i am look at this i'm literally so far away how am i doing any damage this makes no sense ow stop rizzing me up all right and i think we're about to kill her well, let's go ahead and slap her in the face to beat her there we go. And just like that, we have defeated the Cake Queen, which is one of the hardest bosses to be in Blocks Fruits. But boys, I think it's about time we take our absolutely massive sword and troll some of my YouTuber friends with it. Yo? Uh, uh, uh. Uh, me no have no English. Listen here. I challenge you to a 1v1. Okay, easy. Easy? Easy. All right, jump my game. All right, buddy. Where are you at? Why is my game not loading? Dude, why, why is the sky just black? It's because I'm here. It's a daytime now, so. Oh. It's because you're here. 
All right, bro, where are you? I'm trying to find you. Are you inside the cafe? You'll never find me. I'm hiding. All right, let me go ahead and change my weapon really quick to the highest damage weapon in the game. There you are. What are you doing over there? What do you have? You have the hollow scythe? I've come to collect souls. You've come to collect souls? Well, are you ready to 1v1? Are you ready to get... Are we kissing right now? What is going on? Wow. Are you trying to riz me up, bro? Uh-uh. <laughs> Are you ready to 1v1? Yeah, I'm using the best weapon in the game. What's that? The starter katana. Bruh. All right, <laughs> all right. Start whenever you're ready. No, you start whenever you're ready. No, you go ahead. You just go ahead and try to hit me. Just come here. <laughs> Uh, bro, what? What? No, hold up. Dude, you're already red health. Air slash. Oh, uh, dude, you're using like the worst weapon. Let me just murder you really quick. Uh, 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 uh. All right, you know what, stud? Since you're using huge swords, I'm using huge oh, swords. Oh, no. Okay, okay. This might be more of a fair battle, though. Get away. <laughs> How'd you miss? Wait, oh, your PVP's off. Oh, okay. Wait, hold on. Wait, wait. Before you attack me, let's just compare sword size. Oh. Oh, is it, I think mine's uh, bigger. No, I think, my, I think mine was bigger. I think my sword was bigger. I'm not going to lie. Wait, come here. Let me get a closer look. Okay, here, yeah. Bet, 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 bet. Whoa! <laughs> look at me. I'm faster than you. I'm faster than you. I'm faster than you. Uh, oh, 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 yeah! Oh. How did that cancel? Yes. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Wait, how'd yeah. that miss? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, oh, dude, I can't even see what's going on. The swords are all over my screen. Give me your sword. Wait, hold on, bro. Get your little sword away from you. Your little sword. You have three little swords. Yeah. Oh, my God. This yes. is not can fair. Can your sword do that? I don't think so. Come here. Stop oh, running oh, away. No, there's a lot of damage. There's a lot of damage. There's a lot of damage. Come here. Come here. Come here. Come here. What's up, buddy? Oh, God. Oh, God. Come here, oh, buddy. God. Come oh, here. God. Come on back over here. Come here. What's yeah, up? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> no reward. You already killed each other. Three out of three. I only killed you one time. Ha uh ha. -huh. No reward for you. Wait. You have your PvP off. I'm not even scared of you. Oh. Wait, come here, come here. I no, want to give you a no, hug. No, no, stop, no, I stop. want to give you a hug. I don't want your hug. You missed. Uh, oh, come on. <laughs> That's so much damage. Oh, my gosh. Okay, uh-oh. Try doing oh, damage to me oh, now, buddy. Oh, oh, wait. Oh, yeah. Buddha has, like, a ton of damage, doesn't it? Ooh. Slice, oh, slice. Oh, oh. Slice him up. Slice them oh, up. Yes, 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 yes. Come on, come here. Yes. <laughs> Huge swords are overpowered, man. That's what. That's all I gotta say. I'm gonna call an admin and get you banned. You're gonna get me banned? Why? Because you broke the rule. Now burn. I thought we were best friends. Haha, -ha, your PVP's off. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Uh, I think I'm just gonna go over here. Um. Do Buddha battle, Buddha battle with huge come swords. Here. Buddha battle, dude. It does so much less damage. Yeah, how you like that, huh? How you like what do you my mean, big bro? Buddha I'm moves? hitting you. I'm, I'm hitting you more than you're hitting me. Come here, energy core. Okay, run. No, no, no. Mm -mm. He's invincible now. Come here. No, stay away from me. The energy core literally makes him invincible, dude. Come here, let me slice you. I hate it here. I hate. I'm uninstalling. I'm <laughs> deleting here. Roblox. I'm never playing again. No, you left. I'm deleting Roblox and I'm never playing again. Bruh. All right, boys, I'm going to troll another one of my friends. But before we do that, uh, only like 10% of you guys are subscribed. So uh, if you have not subscribed yet, make sure to hit that subscribe button. All right, so since I trolled my friend XDemon, I decided I'm going to troll another person, which is another YouTuber. All right, bro, to make this fair, wait, wait, where'd you go? Where did you go? Oh, there you yeah, are. Yeah, thank you. Yes, sir. Yo, look at my dark blade, the huge dark blade. All right, all right. To make this fair, you can use the dark blade, and I'm going to use a mastery one katana, okay? Yo, that sword is so garbage, bro. I'm to destroy you. <laughs> All right, let's go, let's go, let's go. Listen, man, I have to take it easy on you since I destroyed you the last time. I don't think you even destroyed me last time. That was just like a visual bug, <laughs> visual glitch. All right, tell me when you're ready. Tell me when you're ready. Are you ready to start? Yes, sir. All right, bet. Let's go. Bro, what the? <laughs> Yo, how is that sword so huge? Hey, whoa, 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 whoa. Dude, stop calling my sword huge, bro. That's weird. Okay, no, nah, you're the one that you have <laughs> Dude, we're both so tired right now. It's literally 4 a.m. Yeah, bro, literally. Like, I woke you up at 4 a.m. to do this video. You're almost dead. You're literally almost dead. Like, even if I poked you, you would die. What? No, I'm one shot. <laughs> bro, freak this game, dude. I'm going this sleep. <laughs> Wait, you left, bro. Why'd you leave? Bro, because this game is garbage, bro. This is why I quit blood streets. But yeah, boys, if you enjoyed this video, make sure to subscribe, hit that like button, do all that fun stuff. If you want to see more videos of me trolling my friends, bro, leave a comment and tell me who I should troll next. But yeah, boys, I will see you in the next video. And adios.
All right, boys, so we're back on Blocks Fruits. And, boys, if you can't already tell, I am sick. I have contracted the Ligma virus. Don't ask. Oh, boys, I was thinking I became a ton of different memes in this game. And I've also unlocked a ton of these crazy mythical and legendary fruits to be able to become these meme characters. A few of the memes that I'm going to be becoming in this video are Grimace with the Venom Fruit, Skibbity Toilet with the Buddha Fruit, the Baller with the Magma Fruit, and Eric Carmen with the Dough Fruit. And a lot more. And, boys, if you want to see me do more meme videos on this channel leave a like on this video and also subscribe bro i think if this video gets 5,000 likes i will continue to do series where i just become memes on different roblox games so boys you don't want to miss out on that hit that subscribe button and one more thing before we jump into this video boys we just hit 300,000 subscribers on this channel and 100,000 subscribers on my second channel so boys i just want to say thank you guys so much we have almost a half a million people subscribed to my channels boys and you should totally hit that subscribe button i think only like uh 10 percent of you guys are subscribed but okay boys we're gonna go ahead and hop down here to the cafe and start this video off and we're gonna let this blocks fruits gotcha decide what character we become first based off of whatever fruit we roll all right blocks fruits gotcha come on give me a good fruit so i can become an op meme would you like to buy a random fruit for three hundred thousand? buy at your own risk all right let's go ahead and buy oh look what we got we got the dark fruit so let's go ahead and eat this fruit Blocks Fruit Dark activated. But boys, that meme character is the one and only Death the Wolf in Blocks Fruit. But before I become Death the Wolf, I'll need a few things. The Twin Hooks, a Dark Fruit, Pure Red Haki. <laughs> Dude, I literally just got this Dark Fruit from this guy. But boys, right now, I am Death the Wolf without his Twin Hooks. I have a Dark Blade, which, you know what? It's even scarier this way. Oh my gosh, he spawned in. All right, it's time to die. Oh, and I forgot to mention that I am using Electric Claw for death the wolf because wolves have claws and uh, i thought that would be a cool little like addition if i were to use claws uh with death the wolf but as you can see he has the twin hooks okay i need to be careful i do not know how many times this is gonna take but uh, i'm just gonna keep going until i unlock these uh twin hooks one eternity later Oh, I got it. I got it. I got it. All right, boys. So as you can see, I have my twin hooks at 300 mastery. Now I could try to get them higher, but I think this is going to be fine as I'm just going to be using them mostly for stun attack. So there's Sky Cyclone, which is a pretty mid stun attack, but I'll take it. And then Prehistoric Punt, which uh, essentially like teleports to the player and then kicks them. It's pretty cool. But boys, it is time to go get my red Haki. And dude, I'm pretty sure I already have this Haki from fighting Indra earlier on. All right, the moment of truth. Do I have it? All right, let's see. Enable color. Yes, sir, we have it. And boys, we now have our red Haki. Which, dude, this is just gonna make uh, Death the Wolf look even cooler than he already looks. And I also added this cape. All right, boys, now it is time for me to go ahead and awaken my dark fruit. And dude, this is going to take forever so what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna get a bunch of people from my discord to come help me and uh, anybody who's in this video who helped me uh shout out to you guys if you want to join the discord the link is on the screen right now uh you should definitely join bro we've been having a lot of fun but boys let's do this all right this is the first of five bosses that i have to beat there we go and we beat him and boys i have now awakened dark it is time to do it for 500 fragments yeah bro we got 20,000. we're good let's go and uh but yeah we have to do what we just did four more times so yeah i'll see you when i have it fully upgraded all right boys this is our second time awakening it all right boys and we have gotten another one all right boys so i forgot to record uh me beating the last two trials but boys i have fully awakened dark fruit and dude now i'm gonna go take on some of the bosses in the third c and show you how overpowered or i guess like uh cool dark fruit is dark fruit's definitely not the best fruit in the game in my opinion but boys it's death the wolf you know we had to go with dark fruit for this build i saw other youtubers using other fruits like dragon fruit like dude why are you using dragon fruit with death the wolf even though technically it's not the best i think that i can work with it dude see death the wolf on this boat is pretty goofy i'm not gonna lie <laughs> but i'm on my way to fight the first boss which is the cake queen and boys let me show you my strat with the dark fruit all right boys so a combo that i found with dark fruit is dimensional slash into endless hole and then you can ghastly step away before this thing just absolutely demolishes you. And you can kind of do the same thing with a lot of them. And dude, if you could really time it right, you could even get like a pretty good combo with dimensional slash, endless hole, abysmal darkness, 
and then flash them away. But as you can see, I've got my master to 337 just by farming bosses in uh, the third C. And then also World of Darkness, which is like insanely good. So you can do World of Darkness into that, into this, into this. And then get the frick away before it freaking destroys you. Yeah, this boss is actually one of the harder bosses in the third C. So, dude, even Death the Wolf doesn't want to mess around with the Cake Queen. All right, it's time for you to die, though. I won't even lie. It is time for you to die. And, dude, there's even ways to work the twin hooks into this. But you can do, like, a prehistoric punt. And then, you know, your, your basic combo that you did before. The one that I just showed you. It, it actually works out pretty well. I won't even lie. Oh my gosh. Oh my, did they just merge me through the wall? Oh, look at them. Oh my, oh my gosh. And dude, I actually forgot about electric claw too. So let me, let me see what I can do with this. So I'm thinking you could do electric rampage into a lightning thrust into a thunder, thunder clap and flash. And that's a pretty overpowered move set. And you can pretty much just jump right into the dimensional, the dimensional slash, the abysmal darkness, the endless hole. And then just like ghastly step away. And there's nothing that this boss can really do about it. It's actually a pretty overpowered combo. Electric Rampage into the Lightning Thrust. Into Thunderclap and Flash. Oh, I just merged outside of the wall again, dude. But yeah, dude, it's not a bad little combo at all. And boys, just like that, I'm about to beat the Cake Queen with a freaking Dark Fruit. And uh, it actually was not that difficult to uh, defeat this boss with all of these combos like mixed together. It's actually a pretty decent like little like combo if you need like a good combo to uh, try out. And you've got the benefit of literally being Death the Wolf. So it's extremely overpowered. I just realized I killed it with Electric Claw. So I didn't even get the mastery for my Dark Fruit. Bruh. Dude, what am I even thinking, bro? All right, boys. So now I've gotten people from my Discord. One Leopard user and a, a Booty user. I don't know where he went. But I'm going to be fighting them to test out how good the Death the Wolf build that I made is. But I've got Electric Claw. I've got Dark Fruit. And I have the Twin Hooks. And I'm going to see how good it actually is is three two one go all right so what i want to do is i want to get him with this move first oh my gosh i missed all right let me get him in here there we go okay i need to be careful oh he does some damage dude this is actually one of my first times uh fighting in this game like i have not fought in this game before this there we go there we go the 2000 damage all right, where'd he go? I do not know where he went. Right, he's in the sky. All right, we're going to do Thunderclap and Splash. Oh, did I miss? I missed. There we go. We got him in here. All right, he ran away. He ran away. He ran away. Dimensional Flash. Oh, I barely missed. There we go. And I took him out. So, yeah, it's definitely hard to use. He was a max level Leopard, so I'm actually surprised that I was able to take him out with Dark Fruit. But GG, my friend. Good game. And now this is going to be my bigger challenge. This dude is literally a Buddha Fruit. Uh, I'm a little bit worried uh, that he will destroy me. We're not fighting Puss in Boots no more. We're fighting freaking Buddha, bro. Three, two, one, go. All right, now I need to be very careful with this Buddha. Buddhas are not people to be best. I did not mean to do that attack. I did not mean to do that attack. No, I am misclicking. I missed clicking jeez dude i messed that up so bad i messed that up so freaking bad that only did 1500 damage bro no oh my gosh this buddha is destroying me bro oh god oh god oh god let me get out of here let me get out yeah dude this is a definitely harder battle all right well maybe this is not a good build against buddhas because i'm about to get destroyed here in like two seconds bro like look so, yeah, he can just hit through my attack, dude. Like, I don't even know what I'm supposed to do. But, yeah, dude, shout out to these boys. GG. You know, that was a hard battle. I don't know how the Buddha hit through those hits. If anybody can tell me in the comments, like, I'm trying to get better at combat. And I'm glad that I at least won one battle. But, all right, first things first, guys. You know, Spider-Man does not use portal fruit, okay? Like, this is not canon. So, we're going to have to get this spider fruit, and hopefully this man will give it to us. All right, you freaking goober. Give me the spider fruit. Bye. Oh, I got the blizzard fruit, okay? Well, we're not frozen, okay? We're not going to need the freaking blizzard fruit. So, let's go ahead and store this. And, actually, if I look in my storage, I might actually have the uh, spider fruit already uh, unlocked. Oh, there we go. Let's go ahead and unstore this. And there we go, boys. We have our spider fruit. Dude, ew, this thing's kind of gross. I don't like how these little tentacle things are moving around. Well, you know what? We're going to be like a muck banger. We're just going to eat it anyways, bro. Let's go ahead. 
And there we go. Blocks fruit spider activated. So we now have our spider fruit in. Oh my gosh, wait, I already have it to mastery 288. So now the only thing that we're gonna have to do is awaken the spider fruit. But boys, I'm gonna go ahead and test out these regular spider fruit moves. And uh, we're gonna see how good they are. All right, so I have found a little stinky goober and I'm gonna test out these spider moves on him. Ew! <laughs> All right, but let's go ahead and test out these moves. So we've got this, ow, ow. All right, well, let's go ahead and test out these moves. We've got our Spider Wrath, which is 1,700 damage. It's like a it's like a spider kick move. I don't know. Multi-string attack. Let's see what this is. Okay. 1,800 damage. Not bad. All right. And the overheated sniper, which is obviously like a uh, like a sniper move. 2,400 damage. And it just like knocked him back so far. We've got our flight move, which, you know, it'd be cooler if it was like, like shooting webs. But I guess spiders fly. I don't know. And then we have our ultimate thread move, which... Uh, does a ton of damage. I just killed somebody on accident. He said, Spooderman, ow. Okay, I kind of feel bad. Spider-Man is supposed to not kill people, bro. But boys, now that I have a bunch of goobers with me, we can go ahead and awaken this spider fruit. Oh my gosh, that was a huge explosion. Dude, what is he doing, bro? Oh my gosh. All right, boys, the raid is starting and uh, we've got our big Buddha and I don't even know what the other brutes people are using. But let's go ahead and kill this goober right here. Oh wait, hold on. We did no damage. Oops. You know, I, I haven't hit anything yet. Everybody's just killing them so quickly dude oh my gosh there's a sea beast too all right there's a goober over here oh wait is he dead what's going on all right there we go boom there we go Oh, God. All right, boys. We now have our next move unlocked, which is Thermal Laceration. All right, let me go ahead and check out what this one does, bro. Okay. Um. All right, so this one... Ooh, that's pretty cool. Dude, it's literally like I'm shooting webs, man. I feel like Spider-Man when I use this one. All right, let me go ahead and do this. Uh, 2,500 damage. Not bad at all. All right, multi-string attack. Overheated snipe. Oh, what the heck? Where did he go? Ultimate thread. And, boys, what's crazy is that these moves that I'm using right now are, like, nothing compared to the good ones that we're going to get next. All right, boys, but we can now move on to the next island. And boys, now that we have island two cleared, we have our next move, which literally makes us Spider-Man, bro. We have our web flying ability. So this one is like super cool because we're literally Spider-Man now. All right, bro, but let's go ahead and take out some more of these freaky goobers, bro. All right, there's one right there. So we're going to use our thermal laceration move, 3,000 damage, multi-string attack. Then we're going to do our snipe move. Oh, wait, oops, I, I messed it up. Oops. But yeah, boys, this string highway one is super cool cool watch this you, he'll never see it coming bop <laughs> Seven thousand damage all right boys but we have now defeated the third island moving on to the fourth island and we have our next move which is the silk prison so let's go ahead and spider-man web our way over here and let me show you how overpowered this silk prison move actually is all right so with this silk prison move you shoot webs into the air and then it does a huge area of damage so you can use this like really well in like pvp situations this is like one of the best pvp moves for this uh actual fruit all right, but check this out, boys. So we're gonna have to shoot these webs in the air. Oh, that did 400 damage. Uh, we're gonna go ahead and kill some more of these goobers really quick. All right, now we're gonna do Silk Prison. Here we go. Five thousand, six thousand damage, dude. Yeah, dude, this move is pretty insane, especially if you're fighting more than one person, because you can trap people inside of it, and there's literally nothing that people can do once they're stuck. But boys, we have cleared island number four now, and we're moving on to the uh, fifth island. And boys, we only have one more move to unlock because we just unlocked the Eternal White move. And boys, this. This move is really similar to one of the awakened doe moves so check this out all right first i need to get to this island though they're just destroying this island bro look at, look at everybody with the giant swords <laughs> all right boys the eternal white move is like a like it's like spider legs that like come out eight thousand damage all right boom there we go silk prison go ahead and trap him in there as well use our spider highway to get out of there and then on our way back down we will use our eternal white move to do how much damage dude oh my gosh almost five thousand damage with that move and boys this is the last island so as soon as we beat this island i will have every single awakened spider move go ahead and use a silk prison on the boss and there we go we have done all of the raids all right let's see all right mysterious entity give me my final move so i can become spider-man readings mortal what do you seek ascension do you wish to awaken your v ability for six thousand frags i am going broke this is bad. But of course, there we go. We have now became Spider-Man with every single awakened spider fruit. And boy, shout out to everybody in this server that helped me get this awakened 
spider fruit. I definitely couldn't have done it with all of the goobers that helped me. And boys, now you already know what time it is. You already know what time it is. It's time to troll some goobers in public servers. Okay, boys, so I joined a public server now, and now I'm going to try to find people to troll. Wait, hold on. That guy just respawned. Wait, who just killed this guy? How did he just respawn? All right, anyways, we're going to go try to find our first victim. Ooh, there's a goober right there. Let's go ahead and use our eternal white move. Oh my gosh, that does so much damage. Silk prison, we're going to do this too. Oh God, he's got dough. All right, let's go ahead and see if we can get some more hits. Okay, I forget what the V move does already. What does this do? Okay, okay, chill. All right, where did you go? Where did you go, Goober? I am Spider-Man, I just said. Okay, oh, where is... Oh, he's behind me. Bop, and we go. Boom. Oh, wait, what the heck? How am I missing? Oh, my gosh. He he is lagging. What is going on? Wait, what the... Oh, he's got dough. I forgot he can't take attacks. All right, get over here. Are we going to use Silk Prison on him? There we go. And we're going to use the Eternal White. And then we're going to use Heavy Punishment. Oh, dude, this is actually doing a lot of damage. Bro, wait, where did... Where, what, what is he doing? Get, get over here. Why are you running? Dude, I will just use my spider web move to catch up to you, okay? I Listen, man. I've got I've got Spider-Man abilities now. Bro, he ran out to the ocean. No way. All right, come here. Oh, 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 ow, 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 ow. All right, let's go ahead and do this. Let's see if we can go ahead and get him with another silk prison. There we go. Another eternal white. Did we did we hit him? Where, where'd he go? All right, get back over here. Dude, look at him. He's just running. He's just running away. Oh, he's so low. You think you can just run away from me? Well, too bad. I will I will always catch you. Dude, oh my gosh, this is overpowered. I don't even like Ooh, a fruit spot? Okay. All right, then we, we, we need to take care of this guy really quick. Come here. We're gonna go ahead and just end you really quick. Uh, there we go. We killed him. Fruit detected only 900 meters away. Okay, we gotta find this. Dude, imagine we find another string fruit or another spider fruit, bro. I would give it to somebody else and make them become uh, Miles Morales. All right, boys, I actually think it might be on this uh, castle island over here. All right, where is this fruit? 70 meters away. It's somewhere around here. All right, somewhere we're over here where is it is it oh is that it right there is it oh dude no it's a freaking smoke fruit oh wait it's a spike fruit i i am stupid we're gonna go ahead and just drop this freaking fruit in the ocean dude we don't even want it but boys what i'm gonna do now is i'm gonna try to go find somebody breaking the law because bro spider-man is a man of justice you know we just like murdered somebody for no reason uh so boys let me go ahead and hop in my boat actually we don't need a boat bro we could just <laughs> use our web to go across the ocean but yeah boys let's go find somebody breaking the law all right let's go ahead and see if we see somebody bre okay oh my gosh is that the venom fruit boys i literally just found venom all right i think this is the venom fruit user right here all right man get over here we're gonna go ahead and take you out okay i just murdered him oh 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 let me run help why am i stuck why am i stuck what is happening wait what's going on is it please help get me out of here why am i stuck you stay away from me you stay away from me you stay away from me go away <laughs> oh my gosh i'm stuck in the ground oh i killed another no it's a venom user no <laughs> Dude, what am I supposed to do? What am I supposed to do? Help! Dude, there's a Buddha user too, bro. Did I kill did I kill all of them? Help! <laughs> Help me! Dude, no, 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 no. Bro, what? What? What just happened? All right, now nah, we gotta get our revenge. This freaking goober, I killed them like twice. Cause bro, Venom is my enemy. If you've never seen Spider-Man, bro, Venom is like evil Spider-Man. You guys just killed me, and I'm gonna get my revenge. Dude, we got him. We got the Venom user. <laughs> All right, now we got to get a revenge on this doe guy up here. What's up, man? You think you could just get away with murdering me? I don't think so. Oh, God. Are they are, are they coming after me again? Let me let me go ahead and use my web to escape. Oh, my gosh, dude. It's a Venom user. It's a Awakened Doe user. And it's an Awakened Booty user. And I just killed all of them. Bro, that's because Spider-Man, he's overpowered. I'm so glad that I ate that Spider-Man burger, guys. Like, literally, I would not have gotten this powerful if I didn't eat that stupid Spider-Man burger. Which, I'm not going to lie guys pretty fire man P pretty good burger all right let me go to this little furry really quick <laughs> all right bro what fruit do you think the baller would use mm, something with balls what fruit has balls oh, i think i can think of one what do you think about this bad boy the magma fruit okay bad, bad, bad. that makes sense all right let me devour this magma fruit really quick yeah shove it in your mouth Gosh, bro, why are you staring at me? All right, boys, now that we have our baller fruit unlocked, the magma fruit, it is time to unlock all of the different abilities that this fruit has and become the ultimate baller. So me and this furry right here, look at his little fluffy tail. Yeah, don't be shy, give it a squeeze. 
And yeah, boys, now it is time to unlock all of these different moves that this fruit has and uh, see how overpowered this baller slash magma fruit really is. Dude, it's not the baller fruit. It's the magma fruit. Hey, dude, shut up. Hey, you keep clapping me like that. I'm gonna do it to your mother next. All right, bro, get back here. All right, so the first move is the magma clap. I did no damage. I missed. All right, so the first move is the magma clap. Let's see how much damage. 2,800 damage. Not bad. All right, take this. All right, he's almost dead. Let me give him another good clap. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, he just like disappeared. You killed him. And there we go. We have defeated him. And uh, how, many, how many mastery are we going to get? Oh my gosh. I'm all the way. I'm to 100 mastery already. Wait, really? I have 127 mastery from killing freaking one boss. All right. Well, I have like all of my moves except for one now. All right. But now I'm going to go unlock this final move. All right, furry. Check out these new moves that I've unlocked. We got the magma eruption. Oh, you about to make me erupt. Oh my gosh, dude. What does that even mean? We got the magma fist. Okay, look at that. There's oh. balls right there. Finally, a move with balls. I've been waiting for this moment. Oh, did someone say balls? Hey! And the next move that I unlocked is uh, I become a uh, puddle of circular magma on the floor. Oh, hey, you're burning me, dude. Get out of here. <laughs> dude, I just did 5,000 damage? That's actually insane. I won't even lie, bro. The baller is overpowered. Oh, my gosh. This baller is about to destroy this furry. Come here. No, nope, I'm gone. Come See here. you later. <laughs> All right, now I'm going to unlock my final move which is the ultimate baller move it's going to allow me to throw magma balls at people so uh let me go unlock this real quick all right the next boss that we're fighting is almost dead now so let me uh quickly murder him die <laughs> and there we go dude oh my gosh that's so many levels i'm at uh mastery 162 and i've killed only two bosses you suffocated him with your balls i suffocated him with my massive balls yeah but i now have my final move unlocked which is called magma meteors all right let's check out what this move does let's see oh look at all the balls all over me look at all the balls that i'm dripping on the ground do you see the balls i'm dripping bro oh you got some mighty nice balls i know dude. dude these balls are so round oh my gosh do you hear the sound it's making all right let's see what it does magma meteors oh <laughs> 4,800 damage, almost 5,000 damage from that move. That's actually crazy, bro. The, the baller is overpowered. And now I have something for you, stud. Uh, have a taste of my balls. Whoa. Hey, bro, keep your balls to yourself, honestly, bro. That ball was kind of pathetic. Oh, how about this one? Okay, that ball's pretty big. I'm leaving. <laughs> no, it won't let me leave. All right, but since I have all these baller moves unlocked, it is time to do something which I initially had not said, which is awaken the magma fruit and make the balls even bigger. Dude, I didn't even know your balls could get even bigger. Hey, bro, you're just gonna have to stick around to the end of the video and find out. All right, and the awakening is about to start. All right, there we go. We spawned in. We got our big Buddha furry over here. Dude, I'm just straight shredding them already. No way. <laughs> oh, and that guy's got dough? All right, Magma Clap, come here. Boom. <laughs> All right, it's time to take these dudes out. Magma Clap. All right, Magma Eruption. All right, and then Magma Fist. There we go. Oh, and it does like damage over time. So it does like burn damage. That's pretty cool. All right, it's time to Dude. throw some balls. <laughs> All right, there we go. Island one has been cleared. All right, so let's unlock our first move. Greetings, mortal. What do you seek? Ascension. Do you wish to awaken your Z ability for 500 fragments? Of course, let's do it. All right, now we have our first ability called Magma Shower. Oh, and I unlocked a new title too called the Red Dog. Yo, I think they meant to type the Red Baller. Dude, what are you doing with your hands right now, bro? Dude, I'm just practicing. Let's unlock this next move, bro. I don't know what he's doing. Show me your ball. Oh my God. All right, but now we're on island number two. And let me show you this new move. All right, bro, look at this guy right here. Woo! Oh, my God. <laughs> Dude, literally, he just shoots a bunch of balls at him. All right, die. <laughs> all right, let's see it again, bro. Oh, my gosh. That's actually overpowered. Look at all the balls, man. This is definitely the baller fruit, bro. I don't want to ever hear anybody call this the stupid magma fruit again. This is, from now on, the baller fruit. Your balls are still tiny compared to me, little man. Oh, my gosh. You're still doing that with your hands on. <laughs> All right, now that we've been the second island, it is time to unlock the second move. Do you wish to awaken your F ability for 2,000 fragments? Of course. Ability awaken. All right, so the ability that we unlock next is called Beast Ride. Dude, I have no clue what this one does. All right, let's do it. Uh, Dude, we're literally Whoa. riding balls. <laughs> Hey, get your beast away from me, hey, bro. Hey, bro, you want to ride this ball with me? Come here. No, I don't want to touch your balls. You want to touch these magma balls? Come here. Oh, God. Hey, oh, buddy, no. come here. You want to touch my balls? All right, bro. <laughs> wow. It 
And dude, at the end of it, I can even throw it at my target. All right, boys. Now I'm riding into battle on my freaking magma balls. And uh, let me throw one of these magma balls at this guy. <laughs> Man, we're on the third island. So we're about to unlock our third move. And uh, dude, the moves are just getting better and better. So I have no clue what this next one's about to be. And dude, I'm not going to lie. This baller, dude, he's getting more and more overpowered. This is crazy. And boys, the reason why I became baller is because I made a poll scene. What fruit you guys wanted me to do. And yeah, a fruit was not chosen the baller fruit was chosen so i had to find a fruit that uh essentially is the baller fruit and blocks fruits and yeah dude i definitely found it and there we go it is time to unlock our third move do you wish to awaken your x ability yes sir ability awaken let's see what this one is all right furry where are you i need to find you so i can use this ability on you i don't think i'm ready this time oh, no. <laughs> you definitely don't look ready bro <laughs> yo this dude just said what the age yeah bro i i agree with you i don't know what's going on so i'm gonna explode him Volcanic assault. Oh, yo, bro, that was actually pretty sick, dude. It's kind of like you beat me in the face with the red dodgeball, <laughs> dude. Baller, man, it fits perfectly. Petition to rename the magma fruit to the baller fruit in this game, bro. But, dude, let's go unlock our fourth move. All right, boys, now moving on to the fourth island, I now have the volcanic assault attack. All right, so check this out if I volcanically assault this man. Okay, yeah, that's overpowered. Dude, you just assaulted him to death. Dude, did he die like in one hit? I'm calling the cops on you. <laughs> All right, are you ready to be volcanically assaulted, man? <laughs> that did 3,000 damage. That's crazy, bro. That's a lot of damage. No, that's a lot of damage. Dude, since when did your baller balls become liquid? Liquid baller melty balls, bro. Do you like my baller balls, man? Keep your baller balls away from me. All right, now it's time to awaken our C ability for 4,000 frags, bro. I hope I have enough. There we go. Ability awakened. All right, boys. And now we're moving on to the final island, which is where we're going to be able to unlock our final move, which is actually the most overpowered move for this baller. Oh, and there's a boss spot in it. I forgot to mention that. So yeah, bro, we're going to become the baller and fight the boss of this game. I just did 6,000 damage. That's crazy. All right, bro. There's the boss. Let's do it. Volcanic assault. We just assaulted the boss. Now we're going to use our new move that we just unlocked. The great magma hound. All right, man. Come here. 3,500, 3,000. Oh my gosh, 4,000 4, damage. What? All right, dude, that's actually insane. That's a ton of damage, bro. All right, come here, man. All right, Magma Meteors. So this is the move that's about to be replaced. It just did 8,000 damage, though. So uh, think about how overpowered this move that's going to replace it is going to be. All right, bro, chill. This boss just slapped me in the face. We got CBs helping us, too. There we go. Get some more shots in. We just did 20,000 damage, 24,000 damage, dude. Holy crap. I mean, dude, these CBs are definitely helping as well. Oh my god. Die, stupid boss. Come here. Come here. Dude, I literally can't see anything. All right, I think the boss is almost dead. Let's volcanically assault him one more time. Oh, yeah, he's dead. And there we go. We have every single one of the baller's moves unlocked. Wait, hold on. Not yet. All right, here we go. This guy is going to give us our final move. Do you wish to awaken your V ability for 5,000 fragments? Of course. And there we go. Ability awaken. Dude, we have now become the ultimate baller in blocks fruits, dude. We have every single one of the awakened moves from magma which is one of my favorite fruits in this game hey bro you ready to catch these balls uh -huh. all right but now let's go ahead and test out our final move on this little furry right here dude you have two different tails and one of them is jiggly okay get out of here <laughs> goodbye <laughs> All right, so let's check out this final move, Volcanic Storm. All right, I wonder how much damage this is about to do. Oh my gosh, dude. It's like an Omega Ball. This is oh, the no. almighty baller move. Look at this. It's even smoking. All right, here we go. Oh, no. oh! oh! 3,000, 4,000, almost 5,000 damage, dude. That's nuts. Man, your balls do a lot of damage. I know, dude. My hot, steamy balls just did so much damage All on right, you. All right, nope, you're out of here again. <laughs> All right, man, I know you want to look at my hot CV balls just one more time. Look at this. Oh, no. Please, mercy. <laughs> okay, but as you can see, I have become Grimace in Blocks Fruits. And, uh, wait, what did this guy say? He said, ain't no way. <laughs> All right, boys, but as you can see, I have now become the freaky Grimace. Hey, yeah, bro, this is, this is actually pretty disturbing. Okay, but let's go ahead and try to roll a fruit that looks like Grimace. All right, Blocks Fruits, gotcha. Give me a good fruit, you goober. Would you like to buy a random fruit? Of course. Give me this fruit. Oh, oh. 
Oh my gosh, no way! Bro, we just got a freaking dragon fruit! Oh my gosh, that's insane! Dude, I have four dragon fruits now, including this one. But all right, I'm gonna use Venom in this video because it's got a few moves that are really cool. Check this out. If we want to infect somebody with our freaking Grimace shake, like the shake that I spilled all over my desk and it totally didn't take me a whole hour to clean up, we can literally hit them with these poison daggers and infect them with our purple Grimace shake. We can do a noxious shot and explode them with our purple grimace shake we can even use the toxic fog to lure them in so we can murder them and we can turn into of course our like dragon venom form i still can't believe i got a freaking dragon fruit bro that that is actually insane you know what if this video gets a thousand likes i will give away a dragon fruit in my next video wait this guy just said omg he has headless he's rich give me fruit stud okay you know what well, what if we do give him a fruit we're actually hold on we're gonna give him permanent kilo there we go <laughs> he said bro kilo i want a better fruit than kilo bro you know what if you're gonna be ungrateful i'm not gonna give you it then i hope your dog runs away bro what is this guy's problem i'm gonna say 1v1 me if you lose you have to drink the grimace shake he said 1v1 we can i'm the top g bro why is this gonna be so toxic i clap you and your mom all right, bro. We're definitely gonna one v one. Follow me. Come, come over here, dude. Will he actually one v one me, bro? I will literally destroy him. All right, and we'll activate our purple hockey. I forgot to mention that I have purple hockey. I, I, I literally got that just for this purpose. Hey, wait. Did we start? Did we literally start already? All right, come here. Get over here. <laughs> dude, no way. I literally no, no reward. Level difference is too high, dude. We killed him in one shot. <laughs> now you need to drink the Grimace shake. Bro, the, the, the leopard said, LOL, LOL, LOL. Hey! There's a fruit. Where is the fruit? I need to get the fruit before the leopard. I need to get the fruit before the leopard. Oh my gosh, I have like no health, but as long as I get this fruit, it'll be worth it. Bro, imagine if I got another dragon fruit, bro. No way. What is that? 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 Give me, give me, give me. Dude, falcon fruit. Are you freaking joking, bro? Are you freaking joking? Yo, dude, the bacon leopard said, I almost killed you. Bro, you're using leopard fur. What do you expect? Okay, bet. 1v1 me then. But if you lose, you have to become Grimace like me. All right, come on. We're, we're going to become this. Here we go. Oh! <laughs> Bro, I literally, I literally one-hit him. Why did he do that? You know what, boys? Subscribe right now if you're enjoying this video. I think that 80% of you guys, or like even 90% of you guys, aren't subscribed yet. And if you want to see more videos like this, hit that subscribe button, bro. And boys, don't eat the Grimace shake. Don't do it, or, or else you'll look like me. Our goal in this video is to try to infect as many people as we can with our freaking uh, Grimace shake moves, bro. Look at this. I just think it's so funny. But okay, we need to freaking find this guy. What was this guy's name again? Dude, it was definitely Dingu. <laughs> Look at this goofy uh, avatar. I mean, honestly, as long as we can come across somebody and infect them with this freaking venom fruit, then it'll be totally freaking worth it. All right, let me check this last island because I feel like with that much bounty, you'd probably be around this island or maybe that island. I'm not really sure, bro. It's been a while since I've been on the second sea. I'm not gonna lie. Oh, hold on, bro. I just, I literally just heard somebody jump. Wait. Yo, is that him? No way, no way, no way, no way. Dude, I literally found him. I literally found him again. All right, this is the first guy that I 1v1 and literally one hit. He said, yo, Grimace. Yo, he already knows what's up. Who names themselves freaky Dingu? Want to eat a Grimace shake? If he says yes, I'm literally gonna give him permanent venom. <laughs> like, I'll literally just give it to him. Wait, hold on. There is a goober right there. I, I feel like I maybe should be concerned. Oh, wait, hold on. This guy from my Discord. Okay, shout out. Shout out this guy. He's literally in my Discord. He said, yeah, sure. Okay, bet. Let's just go. Let's just go ahead and kill him really quick. <laughs> no reward level difference too high why you kill me toxic toxic <laughs> bro he's gonna be happy though when i give him the freaking uh when i give him the freaking venom fruit though bro is he trying to attack me right now Wait, is he trying to attack this guy too hey bro should i just like sit here and let him attack me and then murder him like super quickly i wonder if i can literally just kill him with toxic fog let's see let's see if i just stand here with toxic fog if it, if it will kill him if i just don't even hit him once <laughs> it actually worked. All right, I said go to Cafe Dingo. Let's see if he actually goes. If he goes, I will give him a venom fruit. He said no. You said you would drink the Grimace shake, bruh. He said unless you give me a free fruit. Bro, now I don't even want to give it to him. But all right, you know what? I'm just going to go ahead and teleport back to the cafe and see if this freaking goober actually teleported back because I don't even know where he went, bro. Like, I do not see him anywhere. Let me see if I can see him on this. All right, is he in here? Is he in? Oh, he's right here. Okay, bet, 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 bet. Give me a free fruit right now, bro. What the? All right, dude, I literally don't even want 
to give him a fruit. Oh, hold on. Maybe I'll try to give him the, the permanent kilo again. All right, will he, will he walk? Okay, he's coming. He's coming. He's coming. Or I'll hack you, bro. All right, we're going to give him permanent kilo. There we go. He said, dude, give me a better fruit. Hold on. Maybe, maybe. Ma oh, Mag just gave him a freaking ice fruit. Okay, Mag Void. He said, bro, ice? Are you serious right now? This sucks, bro. What? All right, you know what? Since this guy is so ungrateful, who? Oh, wait. What? What is going on? Why, why are they running out there? Where are they going? <laughs> <laughs> he literally just murdered him. All right, hold on. Let's let's see if, let's see if he likes my permanent venom because permanent venom is a lot of freaking robux. Right, we're gonna accept the trade. We're gonna see if he accepts this trade. He said perm venom question mark, bro. This sucks. Bro, how does that suck? All right, it sucks, but he accepted the trade, but I'll take it. All right, you know what? We're just gonna give it to him. We're, since we trolled him so much, we're just gonna give it to him. All right, there we go. We gave him permanent venom. Wait, what did I get? I don't. I actually don't think I got anything from that trade. I just got freaking scammed. All right, I need to type a chat. You need to use it now. You are now like me. He just said, are you a YouTuber? Oh, no, I've been exposed. I look you up on you. Oh, God, no. I hope he doesn't find me, bro. Wait, what is my... No, bro, my username is... Oh, dude, he's gonna find me. Oh, no, you're... Bro, your vids aren't even good. At least make good video. We just gave him permanent venom. We literally just gave him permanent venom. Sub to stud. Okay, there we go. That's better. Bro, he really said your videos suck. They aren't even good. I hope you don't hit one mil, bro. I, I am leaving this game, bro. I just got scammed. Well, boys, little does he know, but, uh, you know, he drank the freaking Grimace shake, okay? He drank the Grimace shake like me, and uh, little does he know, because he got that permanent venom, he's going to end up like the people that drink the Grimace shake. Yo, somebody in chat already noticed me. They said Kenny. Yeah, bro. I'm kind of famous in this game. But, dude, this outfit is definitely not going to work. We're going to need to get Kenny a different accessory, a different fruit, and also a different sword. All right, but what would match with, like, Kenny's orange, like, winter snow uh, outfit? Let me see. There's got to be something that would match super well. All right, we're going to have Kenny wear the black bandana just in case he is not already warm enough in his uh, winter snowsuit. And we're also going to give Kenny the freaking dark blade, bro. Dude, look at how sick Kenny looks with this massive, amazing sword on his back. And, bro, I'm going to give Kenny the flame fruit. So, any one of Kenny's victims will burn to death. And, bro, this is just revenge for all the times that Kenny has died. So, let me eat this fruit really quick. And there we go. Blocks fruit flame has been activated. Do I have this? Uh, bro, I only have a mastery 84. Okay, I need to level this up really quick. But, boys, cue the epic trading mod time. just like that i have unlocked every single one of the flame moves and now it is time to burn everybody it is time for kenny to get revenge for dying so many times in the south park tv show oh yo we have our first victim hey man come here oh bro he's literally almost dead already oh i feel bad i actually kind of feel bad what is he what is he doing oh my, oh my gosh uh you think that you can escape from me? Do you think that you can escape? Oh, yo, there's a boss right here. I'm just gonna let the boss murder him, I think. Dude, imagine if he actually dies to this boss. Oh my gosh, he's so low. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, he actually died to the boss. <laughs> Dude, that is too funny. Okay, we need to actually go find somebody that we can uh, brutally murder now. All right, I think I just saw somebody like flying in the sky over here or something. Yeah, bro, what, what what is that guy doing over there? Okay, let's go murder this guy. Bro, stop running from Kenny. He's gonna get you anyways. All right, this guy's got magma. So we got fire on fire in this battle. All right, bro, where is he? All right, there he is. All right, we've started a battle. <laughs> now he has magma, so I need to be careful. He can't just like fly away with his uh, ability. All right, man, why are you just going to the ceiling? What are you doing up there? All right, there he is. Oh my gosh, is he already dead already? Bro, what do you what do you think you're doing? Well, there is two murders under Keddy's belt. All right, so since I was unable to find a worthy opponent for Keddy, uh, I have found somebody else that uh has bullied Keddy for years, and uh, it's been a long time coming. It's time to get our revenge on Eric Cartman. Shut up, fat ass. All right, man, are you ready to do this 1v1 then? Oh, of course. Of course he's gonna use dough of course bruh what's wrong with my dough i'm not used to using flame fruit oh god oh god oh god oh god oh god stop stop it please please stop it where are you going kenny time to die again hey bro chill chill leave kenny alone man oh Look yeah at you, you want to see fat Look at you bro you you're literally fat? you're literally too slow you're way too slow oh god am oh, i stop stop am stop, I stop, too stop. Slow? dude how did i miss both oh you're so ow 
There we go. There we go. Yes, sir. Oh come here. God. Come here. I will gladly come here. You come here to me. Dude, you keep missing that attack. Why do you keep doing it? <laughs> dude, it's the fatness. I can't aim properly. I know, dude. I understand. You probably can't even, like, move your uh, neck around. Okay. Ow, ow, ow. Oh, I wanted to spike you with my dough. Suffocate you in it. Hey, bro, chills. No, yes! come on. No, yes! no. I was waiting for no, you to crap, get close. Crap, crap, dude. No. Are right, yes, sir. Yes, sir. Come on. No. Yes. Yes, sir. I beat him. Bruh. I beat Carmen. Bro. Yeah. <laughs> no, you're gonna die. You're gonna okay, die. Okay, no, please. chill, chill. But boys, as you can see, we are now Joe Biden. We've got the suit, we got the hair, we've got the the old man face. Hey, boys, now it's time to try to find somebody in game. And uh, wait, hold on. Wait, Joe Biden is old. Maybe we should give him a cane. <laughs> Bro, Joe Biden with his cane. Oh my gosh. All right, boys, but now I think we gotta do something different. We gotta be a little bit more mean with our trolls. Hey, yo, hold up. That's definitely somebody standing out there. Okay, let's see what this guy has to say. I'm just gonna, I'm gonna be friendly look uh, 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 why i was gonna bite and blast him with my drippy bite and ball okay i need to shut up. oh that just reminded me i'm gonna be doing a game die in my discord uh sometime this week i'm gonna be giving away a fruit to somebody probably the buddha fruit because buddha fruit's probably the best fruit for grinding so yeah if you're not already in the discord make sure to join discord.gg slash stud yt all right all right there's a player right here okay this is a little bacon did you vote for me I'm gonna take that as a no. Get over. Oh, I missed. Hold on. Get over here. Oh, wait. Is his PvP off? Bro, his PvP's off. You got lucky today. You're you're lucky that I don't call in a nuclear a nuclear explosion on you or an airstrike. But that's more of an Obama thing. Oh, there's a player right here. Maybe we can ask him. Hey. Oh god, am I lagging or is he lagging? Oh my gosh. Oh, he's a Venom user. Oh no. Oh god, I hope I hope he doesn't hit me. Hey. Whoa! Hey. Did you vote? for me i am joe oh he's he's just leaving why is he why is he just leaving you know what i'm gonna take that as a no you think you ever had an option whether you wanted to vote for joe biden or not get over here oh he turned it <laughs> look he turned into the metal monster <laughs> okay bet, bet 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 Come on, let me. Yes, I got him. I hit him. Dude, hold on. I'm swinging around this massive Venom monster right now. Oh, God. Oh, God. I need, I need to get off of his little. Oh, we hit him again. Run, 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 run. Oh, that does so much damage. All right, where'd he go? Where did he go? Oh, dude, that's so OP. That's so OP. He's... All right, he's good. He's good. Venom is a good fruit, bro. Oh, my gosh. All right, we got to use last resort. Where'd he go? Is he running? Bro, no way. He's freaking running. Get back here. You think you could just not vote for Joe Biden and live? All right, there we go. Come on. Yes, sir. We got him. That's what you get for not voting for Joe Biden. <laughs> okay, hold on. There's a Buddha user out here too. Hey, buddy, come here. Oh, wait. No, that's the guy I just killed. Where's the Buddha guy? I, I literally just saw a Buddha guy out here. Uh, oh, wait. Oh, 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 oh I see. All right, there we go. We hit him. We hit him. Dude, we're in another battle, bro. I'm getting better at PvP. I'm not gonna lie. Hopefully, I don't die now, though. All right, there we go. There we go. Boom. And then we can go ahead and go. Oh, ooh, he escaped. He escaped. Okay. Oh, nice. 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 Ooh. Oh, we barely missed. All right, there we go. We got a good hit. We got a good hit. Come on, hit it. Hit another one. Let's go. Come on. Yes, 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 yes. There we go. Oh, wait. How? I hit him. I hit him. No. Oh, God. That's a lot of damage. That's a lot of damage. Oh, he went before. Oh, this is not good, boys. This is not good. This is not good. This is not good. All right, I'm hiding. <laughs> he just called me a runner. Okay, bet. We're coming back. We're coming back. Bro, I ran because you used V4. Bro, listen. If you use V4 one more time, then I'm going to call in a, a missile strike. Yo, where did this guy go? So, yeah, boys, I'm going to be become the number one hated person. The skibbity toilet. <laughs> hey, yeah, boys, in this video, I'll be using the Buddha fruit to become giant to accomplish this. But, okay, let's go ahead and put on this skibbity toilet outfit. And, yeah, actually, to make this outfit, we need the legs from Core Blocks, which is 17,000 Robux. So, uh, RIP my bank account. But before we jump into the video, if you're enjoying these videos, leave a like on this video. If this video gets a thousand likes, I will become another character in Blocks Fruits. And later in this video, I'm gonna troll YouTubers as Skibbity Toilet too. And boom, there we go. We are now Skibbity Toilet. Oh my gosh, we have somebody already trying to murder us. Oh my gosh. All right, bro. You know what? Just for that, I'm gonna have to uh, become massive Skibbity Toilet and fight back. Come here, you little goober. Come here. Wow. Boom. Wait, how did that not hit? All right, so uh, yeah, I, I think I actually have all of my points in my fruit right now. Uh, Oh my gosh, well, I, why am I struggling right now? Hold on. Will, th will this hit him? Why, why, why is nothing hitting him? Okay, there we go. That hit him. All right, hold on. Let me murder this guy, and then I'll show you what all of these moves, these uh, Skibbity Toilet Buddha moves do. Get over here. 
here, you goober. Come here. Wait, wait why is that the- Oh my gosh, there's a dough user too? Oh god. Oh god. Are, wait, are they teaming? Bro, I literally just joined this server and I'm already getting teamed on. Oh my gosh, wait. <laughs> Wait, what happened? Why am I under the map? Why am I under the map? Uh, I'm glitched, guys. I don't know what I should do. Okay, well, I joined a different server because I got stuck under the freaking map in the last one. And the first thing that I see is uh, cheater. Easy. Hey, V4, cheater. Raid, raid, raid. Easy, easy, bro. What is going on? Oh my gosh, wait. This bacon just noticed me. He said, the hell? He said, ew. Bro, what? Guys, this is not freaking scripted, bro. Like, I literally do not know who this freaking bacon is. You're just mad that I'm better. He said, how? 1v1 me. Okay, there we go. Let's try to get this little bacon to 1v1 me. This isn't the dude that was being toxic, though. So after we uh, 1v1 this guy... Oh, wait, hold on. <gasps> There's the bacon that was me. Dude, why is it always bacons with me, bro? Okay, ooh. What level even are you? I'm level 1,800. I'm lying. I'm actually level max. Oh, no. The bacon's a liar. 2,450. All right, bacon. Come here. You think you can just expose me like that? You think you just expose me like that? Oh, no. He's got ice. Do not ice combo me. He's going to ice combo me. He's... He is gonna ice combo me. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Let me let me let me escape. Chill. Bruh, chill. I feel like ice might be really hard for me to fight. Alright, hold on. Wait. Wait, come here. Come here. <laughs> we literally already killed him. And we got bounty, which means he's not like a super low level. He said cheater, dude. Bruh. <laughs> bro, why did he say cheater? No transforming, bro. Alright, bet. I will beat him even without transforming. I literally gonna have to play this like so tactical. Oh, there we go. We got a hit. We got a hit. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Don't ice combo me. Don't ice combo me. No, 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 no. No, no. Yes, yes! <laughs> we killed him again! Bruh, stupid bomb. What does that even mean? There's the goober. There's the go. Oh, he's, he's enabling BBB again. Is he gonna try to kill me again? Wait, that guy's attacking me too! Ain't no way I'm getting teamed on right now. Please trade me. Okay, this guy's wanting me to trade like mid fight. Oh! No, 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 no. Don't ice combo me. Don't ice combo me. Don't ice combo me. Oh my gosh. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. All right. Come here. All right. Did we get it? Did we? <laughs> we got him again. Dude, no way. We literally killed him three out of three times. He said, bruh. Dude, is he really going to try to kill me again? No way is he going to try to kill me again. There's like no point. I already killed you three times. Bro, this man really must hate skibbity toilets, bro. As soon as I joined the game, he said, ew. <laughs> he walked right up to me. All right, there we go. We hit him once. Go ahead and hit him with that. Oh, oop. He hit me. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. Yes. Yes, save me. Dude, no way. This freaking random person just came in and saved me. No way. Oh, okay. Maybe this guy is not trying to save me anymore. Maybe he's not trying to save me. Okay, we got to run. We got to run. All right, we might need to transform because we've got more than one person attacking us now. Dude, look at the spirit user. He's literally hunting me down. Bro, why does everybody want to murder Skibbity Toilet, bro? Comment down below if you hate or love Skibbity Toilet. All right, here we go. We're doing some damage. We're doing some damage. Okay, we got one kill. We got one kill. All right, come here, you goober. Come here. Where are you? Where are you? I don't even see him, bro. I'm just swinging at nothing. Bro, stop running. I, I totally didn't run like like one minute ago, but like, stop running. What? Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Okay. Chill, chill, chill. Yeah, yeah. Did we get it? Did we? There we go. We got him. Bro, look at that, dude. We're literally on a rampage right now, bro. You know, I'm not even going to go full. Oh, wait. There's another Buddha, bro. This server is insane. Bro, this server is like Ohio, bro. I know that meme died last year, but like actually like that is the word that I would use to describe the server. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. No, 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 Bro, no way the guy that I killed three times, not even the person that just killed me, just said easy when I died, bro. Oh my gosh. All right, I'm not trying to be too toxic in this video, but I feel like you kind of have to be a little bit when you're skibbity toilet, bro. Look at this. We're literally floating, bro. It looks so goofy. I think that my PvP's off, so if this guy tries to hit me, yeah, he literally can't hit me. <laughs> Don't turn on your PvP. Trash. Bro, this guy's being toxic too? Bro, no way this guy's being toxic too. All right, you know what? We're gonna have to get our revenge. We're, this guy just killed us but we're gonna have to get our revenge we're gonna have to enable pvp there we go come here you little goober all right there we go we got a hit we got another hit okay we have four thousand damage all right we did we need to use this quick we need to use this quick okay chill we're gonna use our last resort all right we're doing damage we're doing damage come here come here stop running come here come here stop running come here oh god oh god that that did some damage i'm not gonna lie all right come here come on no no all right come on come on come on come on come on come on get him get him get him get him Dude, no way. No way. Dude, he's so low. He's so low. 
dude, we literally beat him. Let's go. All right, you know what? This server was a success, dude. There was a ton of players that we fought, and that was pretty fun. All right, boys, so since I trolled a bunch of people in a public server, I think it's time that we go ahead and troll some YouTubers. And yeah, the YouTubers that I'm gonna be trolling are It's Maddie and Mango Pool. And yeah, if you guys know Mango Pool, he is a freaking goober, bro. And I already know he's gonna freaking rage. All right, I'm calling It's Maddie right now. Yo, what up, Maddie? What's going on? How are you, bro? What's up? Dude, all right. I need you to join my game right now. Oh, okay. What's going on? No questions asked. Just join my game. Oh, yo, he's in the game. He joined the game. Hey, what's up? What the heck? What are you? <laughs> Do you like my outfit? No, it is terrifying. It disturbs me. What? You don't like my outfit? No, it's weird, bro. Wait, weird. why do you have bunny ears, bro? What What are you? You think you're like a rabbit, bro? Bro, you're literally in a toilet. Where is there any room for you to talk right now? All right, you know what, bro? I'm not going to let you talk to me like that. I'm not going to let you talk to me like that. Get over here. What the heck? No, I'm, I'm, I'm faster than you, bro. I'm no, not no, no, come here, come here, come here, come here. Wait, stop <gasps> running. Why? Why are you running? Why are you running? Why are you running? Why are you running? Dude, you're so fast, bro. Chill. All right, hold on. I'm, I'm gonna catch you. I'm gonna catch you. I'm gonna catch you. No. Yes. Yes. No! Yes. Yes. What is this? Yeah. What is this terrifying Dude, figure? You're literally so fast. Uh oh. What is this? Uh oh. Are you a Fortnite <laughs> character? Oh, I died. Is it actually like disturbing? Do you find it like creepy? Get away from me, Italian guy in the toilet. Is that the only reason why you wanted me to join the game? <laughs> yeah, no, I, ju I just wanted to murder you. I, I literally just wanted to murder you. Oh. Okay. Okay, so I just invited another YouTuber to my private server, and uh, the YouTuber that I invited is called Mango Pool. And boys, if you didn't know, I'm trying to beat Mango Pool to 100k subscribers on my second channel. So boys, while we're waiting for him to join the server, go subscribe to my second channel if you are trying to help me beat this man to 100k. Okay, he just joined the server. Let me get in a call with him. Yo, son, what's up? All right, where are you at, Goober? You're in my game. Where are you? Um, your mom's house. Haha. <laughs> I, I listen. I just want to show you something, okay? I wanted you to join. Like, I don't. I don't. I'm not trying to like one v one you or anything. I just wanted to show you something, okay? Yo, Skibbity Toilet. Yo, what's good, Skibbity Toilet? <laughs> Do you like my outfit? That looks like something I see in my nightmares at 3 a.m. <laughs> Dude, that's what. Uh, that's what Maddie said. One time, I had a dream that Skibbity Toilet was like chasing me. Really? Yeah, bro. Bro. Run. Bro, go away. Dude, I'm a bro. I'm 12 years old. <laughs> Dude, what? I'm 12 what? Years old. <laughs> Bro, what are you talking about? All right, hold on. Come here. Get over here. Come here. Come here. No. Oh my gosh, bro. I literally killed you in two you punches. Hacker, bro. You're literally hacking, dude. You're hacking. Dude, You're shut hacking, up, bro. bro. I'm not hacking. So, dude, I'm going to beat you to 100k subs on Bro, no, you're bro. definitely not, bro. I'm definitely going to beat you. But hold on. Wait. I just realized something, okay? You have the name The Troll in Game, but you just got trolled by Skibbity Toilet. How do you feel? Thank you. Dude, what? You get no woman. Dude, shut up, bro. Your Roblox girlfriend broke up with you. We don't talk about that, okay? What? There we go. We have our Mario outfit, which actually looks pretty good. Guys, what would you rate my outfit? 10 out of 10. What would you rate this amazing Mario outfit? Comment down below. Okay, so now that we have his outfit, we need to get him his weapon. And boys, we're gonna need to head to the first seat to get this weapon for Mario. Oh my gosh, dude, Mario ate one of those like uh, white flowers. I got flames everywhere. But boys, the item that we're gonna get is the pipe. <laughs> they literally have like the perfect weapon for Mario in Bloxburg. That's crazy. And it only costs 100,000. That's nuts. All right, boys, but we're gonna need to head straight to the frozen village to go get this freaking pipe, dude. This is gonna be perfect for mario all right boys and we have arrived all right i think that we need to go talk to this guy right here the sword dealer of the east a bit far from home aren't you which sword would you like to purchase well i'm not here to buy a sword yeah bro we traveled all the way to this sea to buy a pipe you know there we go <laughs> and there we go look at this pipe dude this thing's sick how much damage does it do all right well it's gonna one shot this guy pretty much oh my gosh it doesn't even one shot uh this thing might be <laughs> garbage uh I mean, what did I expect? It's literally a freaking pipe, dude. <laughs> okay, but now let's go back to the second seat and pick out Mario's fruit. Okay, boys, we're back on the second seat. We have our pipe. We have our Mario outfit. And now it's time to pick out a fruit for Mario. And I think I know what I'm going to do. All right, Blocks Fruit Dealer, what do you got for me? Boys, I think I'm going to be Mario with the flame fruit. So yeah, dude, I'm Mario if he ate the white flower. 
<laughs> dude, imagine if they had like a mushroom fruit, dude, man. I, I, I wish that they had like a mushroom fruit. But boys, now it's time to take on some bosses as Mario, since we have everything that we need. And bro, this island literally looks like the perfect island to uh, defeat a boss on. Like, look, there's literally like mushrooms like in the mushroom kingdom. <laughs> All right, man, where is this boss at? We got to take him out to move on to the next game and become the next character, which uh, by the way is Bowser. All right, I think the boss is gonna be right here. Yes, sir. All right, you ugly man. Are you ready to die to Mario? <laughs> Prominence blast. Oh my gosh, wait, I don't have my uh, stat points in uh, my blocks fruit. Uh. Oh, what is going on? Okay, I'm running, I'm running, I'm running. All right, now I have my uh, fruit the way it needs to be. Let's uh, let's take out this boss. All right, let's do a prominence burst. Look at that. Mario's white flower move is too overpowered. We got flaming vortex, which sent me flying in the air. Oh, God, there's meteors everywhere. Uh, oh, my gosh, how am I avoiding all this? We've got hell's core, which is my personal favorite. And there's more meteors. Oh, my gosh. And, boys, that's not all. We've still got our pipe. Look at this amazing uh, weapon right here. All right, where did he go? Why? why are you hiding over here get, get over here you, you just don't want to fight me with this pipe you're scared of the pipe bro i don't know i don't i just think he don't want to get piped by mario i mean peach probably would and boys hold on what if i go up to this mushroom and eat it really quick <laughs> there we go dude this looks disgusting oh my gosh oh my gosh dude what, what the hell Dude, look at my little pipe in my hand as there's like a bunch of bombs going off in the background. All right, come here. Get over here. I'm going to smack you with my pipe and let's throw some fire at him. <laughs> Dude, I want to use Hell's Core as the uh, big giant Mario, the disturbing Mario. Dude, look at how big I am compared to him. All right, but let's test out Hell's Core. Oh my gosh. There we go. And there we go. I defeated him. All right, I look, I look disturbing though. Let me just fly away on my rocket. <laughs> Dude, this looks so cursed. Yo, hold on. What if Mario ate this even bigger mushroom, bro? <laughs> oh my gosh, I'm so massive. Dude, I literally can't see anything. I literally can't see. I can't zoom out any further than this. All right, there we go. I can zoom out now, dude. Look at how huge I am. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna walk up to this guy and I'm just gonna straight up call him bad in this game. I said, you're bad. Is he just gonna ignore me? Is he just... What is he doing? Is he trying to go down? <laughs> where, where is he going, bro? Hey, I'm talking to you. Bro, is he really just gonna ignore me like this? What the? Bro, he, he's really he's really ignoring me. What, what is going on right now? Listen, man, do not ignore me. I will take out this rage of Eric Carbon on you right now, bro. Hold on, where you go? Come here. Bop, there we go. And then let's see if we can get a piercing. Oh, I messed up the piercing clothesline. Oh, God, he's actually at pretty high level if he's actually taking damage from me and not being hurt. Bop, there we go. And then we could uh, hit him with this really quick too. Wait, come on, jump into it. Jump. How'd that not hit him? What the? Yeah, bro, nice miss, nice miss. Look at him, bro. <laughs> dude, why is it doing like no damage at all? Cause I don't have my hotkey on, bro. What the? Dude, what is going on? Where, why? Where, he's hiding from me. Why is he hiding? Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Let me run, please. Let me run. No, no, let me run. How's that? Okay, is it hitting him? Why is it doing no? Wait, wait. Do I not have my stats? I have no stats in blocks fruits. Oh, I'm a freak, and I have no robux. Oh. Uh Okay, I'm in trouble. I'm in trouble. I need to run. I need to run. <laughs> He's coming. Dude, I have no stats in my freaking... Uh, in my blocks fruit. Oh my gosh. Okay. Can I transfer Robux really quick? All right. Transfer Robux. Where'd this guy go? I, I think I can do the stat refund. Can I do it? Okay, there we go. I can do it. I can do it. Bro, where'd he go? Where'd this guy go? Oh my gosh. This is the most intense battle I've done in a while. Bro, where did he go? Did I lose him? Bro, no way. Did he go back in here? All right. Well, I think I'm just going to pick on this guy now. You're easy. I could kill you in a 1v1. Why did you bleep it out? Wait, I just realized he said Eric Cartman. <laughs> I kind of feel bad now for being toxic. All right, all right. I'm about to fight this guy right now. We're coming out here to settle the battle. Where, where is he going, bro? Is he just going to run away from me? What's going on? Is he just going to run away? Get, on, get, get back here. Get back here. Where are you going? Come here. Is he Is he really just going to... He's just... He said, he said bet. Come on. And now he's just... He's just flying away. I will literally follow you till the ends of the earth, man. I will follow you. Oh, he's running. He's running. Come on. No, 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 no. Bro, is he really just running away? What is he doing? Yes, I got him. I got him. I got him. Come on, can I hit him again? There we go. Can I hit him with this? Oh, wait, dude, did we just take him out that easily? Dude. Okay, wait. He's almost dead. Where'd he go? Uh, oh, there he is. There he is. There he is. He's going to try to run. Go me. <laughs> that's right. You were no match for Eric Cartman. And I think that's going to kill him. Bop. There we go. No reward. Level difference too high. Yeah, bro. That's just like Eric Cartman picking on somebody not his own size. Because, you know, Eric Cartman's absolutely massive and fat. 
Yo, he just called me ugly. Bruh. I just said, am I fat? He said, bro. Uh. Wait, did he just leave the game? <laughs> Wait, I think he just left the game. <laughs> oh, no, he didn't. Okay. He said, shut up, fat. Oh, my gosh. Yeah, I know what he's trying to say. He's trying to bypass the Roblox filter. Before I call Kyle, bro. <laughs> All right, you know, I actually feel kind of bad. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to teleport this dude to the cafe and give him a good fruit. Since it wasn't really a fair battle because, uh, like, I don't think he's even, like, max level in this game. And I am. All right, let's see. We're going we're gonna to bring him to the cafe. All right, there we go. We're giving him a free rumble fruit because I honestly feel kind of bad. All right, and there we go <laughs> i said we do a little bit of trolling <laughs> dude, he said you're not fat cool thanks bro <laughs> Sheesh, dude look at this dude miles morales with the ttk out here looking drippy all right hold on and you know what we're, we're gonna go ahead we're gonna go ahead and give him a, a cape because you know in the actual movie spider-man tells him that capes are are stupid okay but no we're using a cape in this video all right hold on do i have the portal fruit unlocked do i already I think that I might. All right, there we go. I do. All right, let's equip. Let's see what level I have. I have a mastery 210. Ooh, so I have every move except for the last mastery 300 move. So you already know, boys, we are about to go to the third C so that we can unlock this final move. But boys, while we wait for my captain to take me to the third C, if you are interested in trading on blocks routes, playing combat warriors, like Dabba Battlegrounds, anything like that, then join my Discord server, bro, because we just added a bunch of new channels and a bunch of new roles. All right, boys, but we have finally made it to the docks in the third sea and uh i'm trying to make my way to the castle on the sea way over there now what i could do is walk up to this guy and buy a boat hop into this thing and trying to get all the way over there with just this little dinghy would literally take forever so boys it's time to showcase the first move that i'm gonna show you with this portal fruit which is the world warp move if i go ahead and click c uh a little gateway pops up and uh, essentially i can teleport to any place on the map so sea castle is where I want to go. So let's click there and boom. We have teleported to the sea castle just like that. Something that would have taken like a few minutes to get to. We got there in no time. Hey, yo, bro. Maybe I should uh, use this fruit to locate my dad. Maybe, maybe it would know. Is it, is it on there somewhere? All right. Well, anyways, what I want to do is I want to get my portal fruit to a uh, mastery 300. As you can see, dimensional rift is the move that unlocks at a uh, max level mastery. And uh, the only way that we're going to do that is by pretty much murdering bosses. So let's go ahead and buy the respawn bosses. There we go. And boys, while I'm fighting these bosses, I'm going to go ahead and showcase what these other portal fruit moves are. All right. And our first boss is this little ugly goober right here. The captain elephant. All right, boys. So the first move is the portal dash and this move does about uh oh it does 2800 damage not bad but bro my explanation for spider-man using this portal move is uh Bagel. All right, but anyways, let me go ahead and show you the next move, which is Parallel Escape. All right, so uh, if we do this, look at this. We can literally run right beside him and then run away, and it does some damage. Let's say that I am uh, in the middle of a fight with this little Captain Elephant right here. Come here, little goober. Let's go ahead and do some damage on him. Let's say that we're in this fight, and then we get, like, a little bit too close. We get a little bit too close. He starts hitting us. We can go ahead. Oh, that's the wrong move. We can go ahead and click the X move and just, like, run away, and he can't see us, and we've literally just disappeared and escaped without him being able to hit us one time and boys the next move is actually a pretty cool one so let's let me go ahead and do it uh it's it's the f move quantum leap there we go now if we get this little elephant guy to walk into that <laughs> it does damage and it makes him literally teleport inside of a thing bro all right that's kind of funny i'm not even gonna lie hey yo you know what i just realized though in order to do more damage what we can do is go over to this guy and uh put on a hockey so let me go ahead and put on the red hockey for uh miles morales spider man boom there we go okay this looks kind of sick bro i don't even gonna lie guys comment down below what you would rate this miles morales spider-man outfit all right boys but now that we have our cape our outfit and our portal fruit it is time to go ahead and get my portal fruit to mastery 300 so that we can unlock the final and most overpowered move the dimensional rift so cue the montage <laughs> All right, boys, and just like that, we have gotten our portal fruit to mastery 299. And we only need to get one more kill to get our portal fruit to maximum amount of mastery. All right, Captain Elephant, I tested out my portal moves on you earlier, but now it's time for me to finish you off so I can unlock my last move. Dude, look at that. 
<laughs> I just flop it around. Oh, it just did like double damage. So we can smack him again with that. Bro, this portal fruit is actually insane, bro. You know, maybe one of these times my dad will pop out of one. Quantum leap. Dude, did I just find a freaking... Hold on. Yeah, come, come over here. Wait, wait, come over here. No way. If I just stand right here... <laughs> He's like stuck in a loop, bro. No, no freaking way. All right, hold on. I'm gonna, I'm gonna try it again. Nah, I'm, I'm literally just gonna kill him like this. I'm literally just gonna kill him by doing this. This is, this is how I'm gonna beat this boss. He just, he's just constantly taking damage. It's a thousand points per hit. And there we go. New skill available, and we got the item drop, the twin hooks. But boys, as you can see right here, dimensional rift. This move is probably one of the coolest moves that you can unlock for a fruit in all of Blocks fruits. And I'm gonna show you how cool it is on one of my friends. All right, boys, so I found this wild uh, goose out here, and I'm gonna show you this brand new portal move on this goose. All right, little goose, are you ready? Here we go, three, two, one. <laughs> this is my first time doing this, so it takes us to another dimension, the dimensional rift. And then we can go ahead and use our moves on this goose. Look at him, he's like, <laughs> bro, he's so confused, he's just looking around. And bro, there's literally no escape. Once you're in here, you are freaking stuck. So yeah, this kind of reminded me of the new Spider-Man movie, Spider-Man Into the Spider-Verse. By the way, this is not sponsored. Spider-Man should totally sponsor me, though, to make another video. And boom, and boom. Woohoo! Uh oh but boys and just like that we can go ahead and close it and oh my gosh i am getting destroyed by this goose run hey yeah boys what i'm going to do now is i'm going to join public servers and i'm going to use this portal fruit to get a kill on a, a goober in a game and boys i'm also going to try to get a kill with the one and only spider-man fruit or the spider fruit all right boys but we are now in the second seat and it is time to try to find our first victim dude i just realized that i've had this uh, true triple katana on me this entire time well I guess it's staying with us now, bro. All right, is there anybody out here that wants to fight? I'm looking for a Venom user. Ooh, actually, we can roll a fruit. Let me see if Spider-Man's got some luck in rolling fruits. All right, bye. Bro, we got the freaking diamond fruit. Let's go ahead and just throw this on the ground. Bro, I'm really feeling like Spider-Man right now, looking down on this city, making sure nobody's committing any crimes. Hey, yo, hold up. What do I see over here? Is that a massive Buddha murdering a bunch of innocent campers? All right, Spider-Man is on his way to investigate. Gate. Oh my gosh, it's a furry. All right, you know what? It doesn't even matter, bro. You know what? Spider-Man is going full on Sigma mode and attacking this furry. Look at it, bro. <laughs> he said hi. Okay, I kind of feel bad now. Uh, I am Spider-Man. He said nice. Do you know my real name? If he says Miles Morales, I'm gonna have to kill him because that means my secret disguise as Spider-Man is ruined. Miles? Oh no! He knows who I am. No, I've got to kill him now. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. Oh god. Oh, I just. I killed him. Bro, literally, I went to pull him into my dimensional rift, and uh, and he died. He couldn't handle it. Nobody can know my secret identity. All right, well, anyways, let's go ahead and close this dimensional rift. Their crime was uh, wearing a fursuit, by the way. That was the only crime. I didn't care about the people that were innocently trying to camp. I more or less just cared about the fursuit that he was wearing. Okay, boys, so since we did get a kill with the portal fruit, I feel like it's time that we use the spider fruit. So we go ahead and open up shop, and there we go. Blocks fruit spider activated and guys i'm not gonna lie this might be one of my favorite fruits look at this web swinging ability bro that's so sick hey yo hold on we got a factory raid let's see if we can maybe get a fruit out of this Ten thousand damage oh my gosh oh wait oh and it ended and we didn't get a fruit all right well we can go ahead and try to murder somebody though i think we need to try to get this v4 user yeah let's do it Oh, wait, his PvP is off. Bruh. But anyways, let me go try to find some criminals that I can take out. And boys, I'm gonna be heading to the first seat to try to find people that are picking on low levels to try to get justice for all the low levels getting trolled. Okay, so I joined the server, and the first thing that I see is that there is a 3.8 million bounty person here. He is definitely up to no good in this server. He is definitely trying to pick on some little goobers trying to grind. So boys, let's go ahead and get a bow, and let's try to go find this guy. Hey, yo, is this guy trying to come kill me? right now oh he is okay 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 we just found somebody in the in our first server that we joined okay we gotta get we gotta go heal up really quick okay chill i'm gonna go ahead and go as high as i can up in the sky because he's already done a bunch of damage on me all right there he is look at this little goober all right we're gonna go ahead and get him in a silk prison there we go get some thermal lacerations can i hit him with this come here bro come here there we go there we go we're getting some good hits we're gonna get some good hits come here you freaking goober come back oh god oh god okay i can't let him get too close oh there's an ice user too 
you. All right, I don't know. I don't know what team this ice user guy is on. I don't know if he's gonna be friendly to me or not, but I'm trying to be a hero right now. Let me just swing my web really quick. Let me get him in another silk prison. There we go. Oh, oh, I killed someone. I killed someone. Can I kill you too? Come on, come on, die, die, dude. Oh my, dude, he's gotta be so low. He's gotta be so low. Come here. Why are you running? Why are you running? Oh, ow, ow, ow. That hurt. That freaking hurt. Yo, the ice user's back. He undid his Buddha. Come on. Can we hit someone? Can we hit someone? Oh, he died. He died. The Buddha user died. Dude, no. No, no, no. Come on. Let me up. Let me move. Let me move. Oh, God. I'm low. I'm freaking low, bro. I'm freaking low. <laughs> I'm literally just like running away. All right. We're taking it to the Coliseum. I think I finally got enough health. Oh, wait. Are we going to 1v1? Like friendly 1v1? Okay. Maybe this guy isn't such a bad guy. Okay. Here we go. I, I, I'm actually so confused. I don't know if this is the guy that I was 1v1ing before or not, but this guy's about to die. I'm not going to lie. You're like already dead, brother. All right. There we go. There we go. And I would. GG. Wait. This is. This, all right. This was the guy that was chasing me. All right. Hold on. Wait. There's so many people there's so many people just like watching us fight now what the but yeah boys no hate to furries no hate to slenders um maybe a little bit of hate towards hackers but yeah boys this video is just for the memes it's just for jokes it's just for fun so i hope i didn't offend anybody by becoming toxic characters well boys today i turned a bunch of different bosses from blocks fruits into different memes and i'll be defeating them from easiest to hardest boss but boys here we are in the first sea and this is actually where we're going to find our first meme boss so let me uh go to the luxury boat dealer right here and we'll go to the island where this boss is waiting to be murdered by me on all right boys but we are arriving to fight our first boss which is at this island so this boss is actually going to be the weakest out of all the bosses that we're gonna fight all right bro let's see who this boss is going to be <laughs> dude it's andrew tay okay chill now, uh, the thing about Andrew Tate is he does, like, no damage whatsoever. I can literally sit here all day and not die to his hit. But, uh, I can't say the same for him, bro. <laughs> literally just going leopard almost made him die. All right, hold on. Can I just, like, slap him and he'll die? Okay, one slap, two slap. <laughs> and he's already dead, bro. Dude, Andrew Tate is light work. Oh, my gosh. But like I said, that boss is literally the weakest boss out of every boss that we're about to fight. And, boys, the next boss that we're going to fight is going to be in the second C. I can take it to the second C. Would you like to go? Well, I, yeah, I guess I'll go. Okay, so we have made it to the second C. And uh, it is time to fight our next meme boss. And, boys, our next meme boss is going to be up on top of this hill right right here and you might be saying stud that boss is jeremy well boys not today because today the second boss that i will be fighting is giga chat but since we're in the second scene, this is about to be, like, super easy, dude. I'm literally max level. All right, Giga Chad, it is time for you to die. <laughs> All right, Ember Annihilation. Infernal Vortex. Oh, my gosh. He's, like, almost dead already. All right, dude. And now I feel like the only thing we have to do is a dough all over Giga Chad. We're going to fill up Giga Chad with all of our dough. <laughs> oh, my gosh, dude. All right. It's, am I literally about to destroy him this quickly? All right, Giga Chad, it's time for you to die. And there we go. We have defeated our next boss so yeah that's two bosses down and bro these third sea bosses which is where i'm going right now are literally going to be even scarier dude and boys if you're still watching this far into the video make sure to hit that subscribe button because over 90 percent of you guys still aren't subscribed yet all right so since we just defeated giga chat it is time to now go and fight the three hardest bosses in the game which are located on the third sea i can take you to the third sea would you like to go let's do it all right boys we have made it to the third sea and we still have three different bosses that we're gonna have have to defeat and dude these bosses are not going to be easy like the last ones and our first boss is actually on this turtle island and he's going to be located inside of like this castle all right they can just right around this corner and yes there is this is where our next boss is going to be located oh god who is it gonna be <laughs> yo it's the baller bro baller. hey yo what sword is that bro that is a nice sword mr baller you know uh, i feel like this should be the slicer and not the baller because you know the baller would be throwing his balls at me right now and yeah the fruit that i'm gonna use to destroy this baller is i'm gonna destroy him with his own ball except instead of regular balls i'm gonna be using magma balls yeah dude the baller is not ready for my balls four thousand five thousand damage all right where are you at come here you were literally gonna destroy him like so quickly oh my 
my gosh. Okay, let me uh, let me turn my hotkey on. Oh my god. Great magma hound. <laughs> All right, baller, come here. Oh my gosh. All right, die. All right, die. There we go. Ten thousand damage. We'll do a magma shower on him. Throwing all of these balls in his face. Volcanic assault. All right, chill. Ow, baller, stop. He's got my half health. Baller, leave me alone. Listen, I just want to murder you, okay? Just, just let me murder you. All right, baller. We're, we're literally doing so much damage. Like, we're doing an insane amount of damage. I hope he doesn't kill me. I'm actually kind of scared. All right, baller, chill. Chill, 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 chill. Baller, chill, bro. Just let me murder you, bro. Just let me kill you. All right, where is he? He's somewhere. Oh, God, he came running out of the magma. I have 2,000 health. I have 2,000 health. I have 2,000 health. Uh, oh. Where'd he go? There he is again. All right, come on. Come on, come on. We need to kill him. We need to kill him. No. Oh my gosh, we have 900 health. Okay, I'm in trouble. I'm in trouble. Oh, I'm in trouble. I am in trouble. I'm in trouble. I'm in trouble. Oh my gosh. Oh wait, there we go. We got him. <laughs> there we go, bro. We've defeated the baller, bro. And honestly, that was the hardest battle yet. I don't know how he got me so low, dude. I guess my balls were uh, almost not powerful enough to beat the almighty baller. Yeah, dude, I don't know. I don't know why I'm talking about balls so much. But uh, yeah, let's move on to the next boss. All right, boys, the next boss that we're going to be fighting is going to be right behind this wall. And, boys, let's see who it is. And, hey, it's my boy, Kenny. What up? What's up, Kenny? Hey, stop. Oh my gosh, dude, is Kenny trying to riz me up right now? And dude, I got a lot of comments on my Kenny video that I should have used revive fruit. So I'm gonna be using revive fruit to uh, murder Kenny. All right, Kenny, I'm killing you with your own fruit. I, I hope that you don't get upset. Yo, dude, I just realized that my revive fruit is mastery one and I have no moves unlocked. Uh, all right, we're gonna have to take this guy out. All right, Kenny, I'm so sorry, but but you're gonna have to die for like the hundred millionth time, bro. All right, chill. Stop trying to riz me up, Kenny. Stop. Dude, oh my gosh, I launched him again. Kenny, stop it. Stop it, Kenny. Stop. All right, boys, so Kenny. Kenny's literally almost dead for like the 10 millionth time, bro. Like, dude, Kenny, you've died a lot, man. I'm not gonna lie. Bop, boom, boom, pop. I'm about to end this man's whole career. All right, boys. And there we go. We have defeated Kenny. Wait, am I gonna have full mastery just by killing him? I, I literally have every single move on lockdown just by killing Kenny that one freaking time, bro. That's like extremely overpowered. All right, hold on. What do these moves do? All right, so we know what possession does. All right, what does soul ruler do? Uh, resurrection? What does that do? Uh, next time you die, you'll be revived at 50% health. Oh, I bet it just, like, heals me. That That's weird. All right, and wandering soul. Okay, I can, like, travel as a ghost. That's kind of cool. All right, boys. Well, now it's time to move on to the next meme boss. And boom, we are to our next location, which is a massive ice cream cone. I wonder who loves ice cream so much that they would live inside of a massive ice cream cone. Oh, uh, literally, it's a massive ice cream thing. All right, bro, who is it gonna be? <laughs> it's Joseph Biden. Hello. Hey, dude, why is Joe Biden in Blocks Fruits? Hey, chill. Biden blast. Yeah. Oh my gosh, he just did the Biden blast. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, he keeps biting, blasting me. Oh my gosh. Hey, Joe, listen, I'm not gonna let that slide, okay? Like, like you could probably bite and blast other people, but I'm, I, I, listen, I don't take that kind of disrespect. Ow, he just biting, blasted me again. Don't you have like a country to run or something? Why are you, why are you biting, blasting me everywhere? All right, but what fruit should I use to murder this man? Let's see. Dude, what if we use the kilo fruit? Literally like the worst fruit in the game. All right, come here, Biden. Time for you. Oh god, I missed. All right, Biden, come here. How much damage do these do? Do, do these even do like any good damage at all? All right, let me see. So we're gonna smash him once. We're gonna smash Biden again, and we're gonna smash Biden a third time. Oh my gosh, dude, he's got so much health. Why does he have so much health, dude? He's like taking no damage. Boom, bop. Biden blasted again, dude. Oh my gosh. Oh, Biden, stop, please. Biden, no, dude, he's gonna do so much damage. Oh my gosh. <laughs> He's flying so far. Look at him. He's like waiting for me, dude. He's literally just sitting right at the door. I see your sword, you freaking idiot. I literally see your sword. Oh, run. Bro, who, who can say that they smash Joe Biden? Like, like nobody. Like, I'm the only person that can say that they smash Joe. Beside Jill. Smash. <laughs> smash. Smash. <laughs> hey! Die. Stupid idiot. Die. Die. Let me smash you. Hold on. Where'd you go? Die. Get smashed. Oh, I just knocked him out of the window. Oh, God. He's behind me. <laughs> Dude, I literally just juked him out and I made him fall on the floor. I'm falling and I can't get up. Yo, Joe Biden needs life alert. What is going on? All right, boys, we are about to defeat Joe Biden with the kilo fruit in three, two, one. Boom, boom, and there we go. And we've leveled up our kilo fruit quite a lot, actually. Hold on, we, we got this uh, to mastery 171. Holy crap. But boys, there we go. We have defeated our next boss. All right, boys, I've arrived to my next location, which is a tree. And uh, what character lives in the uh, the bottom part, the trunk of
of a tree. And boys, I'm not gonna lie, this boss is uh, gonna be the most overpowered one yet. So just in case I die, make sure to hit that like button, subscribe, do all that stuff. Over 90% of you guys aren't subscribed yet, so make sure to hit that sub button, bro. But okay, let's see who it's gonna be. Oh, dude, it's freaking Shrek. Man, I really hope I can defeat him. Look at him back there, it's so menacing. All right, boys, make sure to hit that sub button. Here we go. Shrek! 